Hello and welcome to an episode of Delight in the Seat. I'm joined today by Gabriel Ifrael. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Landon Caldoun. Hello. <laughs> Braylon Velcro. That's all I got, That's all I got for you. Uh, uh, hello. Taylor Isla. Hello. Um, Rich Leaposi may or may not be here. I'll be here later. Don't worry yeah. about it. Hello, everybody. My name is Rich. She has oh, some shit. business to do first, but she will return eventually, probably. And today, you might have heard him mm. rustling around in the background. We have a very special guest who has been <laughs> chomping at the bit <laughs> to come. You've heard him. We've mentioned him before. He's the legendary, the one, the only, the man, the myth on many lists, not allowed to fly in the U.S., Clayton. Y'all already know it. Thank y'all for letting me be here. I'm my mom. I've been waiting for this moment for my whole damn motherfucking life and shit, bro. Thank y'all, man. I love y'all motherfuckers. I love y'all motherfuckers. I see y'all with the hood out here and shit, bro. I love y'all. <laughs> All right. Okay, then. <laughs> That's clean. Such a good intro. So. Good intro. Last time on Dragon Ball Z. The squad arrived at the city of Mortal. Um, they spent some time uh, exploring the city. It was a great time. Uh, Velfi got some new weapons. They met Mike the fruit salesman. Bought some fruit. <clears throat> there was a custody battle. It was a whole thing. We're not getting into it right now. Yeah. It was really a little bit of threatening. Battle. I want really to get rid of it. Also some threatening of the salesman. Khaldun did some and the salesman threatening you. And finally found out where the hell they actually were. And the day culminated in the late afternoon with Khaldun sneaking into a mental asylum <clears throat> and inciting a rebellion that resulted in the death of several um, staff and the release of everyone inside the mental It's asylum. fine, they were racist. What Just realized my chair it. may have been history is written by the commentary. winners, and I won all over that sanatorium. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's a church now. Oh, basically. Speaking of which, while the session ended, last episode ended with um, the crew going to sleep, we're going to pull back just a little bit, just an hour or two, to during that little rebellion. <clears throat> and we're going to actually begin right after Khaldun incited it. So, camera camera pans in to a dark hallway. Empty. But they line on the floor that says, Do not cross under any circumstances. Beyond this line is a door. Behind and behind that door is Jotaro Kujo. <laughs> is, is Jotaro Kujo. No. Behind Breaking. that door is a special cell that contains the most deranged Whoa. and dangerous that this asylum has to offer. Please, introduce your character, Clayton. <laughs> oh hell no, nah, it's 29 degrees. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Here. You are very excited to hear those words, weren't you, Gordon? <laughs> listening, listening to the man in the wall. He's listening to the man in the wall. They're constant, constantly speaking. He's the living embodiment of I'm talking to the to man in the mirror. <laughs> I long to be free. I am the vessel. The conduit for grave power. Blessed be Abadendox. Okay. <laughs> I'm resisting the urge from just saying lots of really nasty stuff. <laughs> I like that I had to, and I was expecting like a simple thing like his name is this. This is what he looks like. Nah, no, nah, we immediately got into it. Okay. Literally, what else did you expect from Clayton? I don't know, man. It's like, what else are you expecting from 
what else are you expecting from the guy who demanded that Gabriel give him a cup of his blood, like, less than a week ago? Seriously, to what sacrifice coyotes? You know, whatever, it's fine. You don't have to you know, hang around this guy every day. <laughs> you know, if, if I could, I would have actually gotten you my blood. Like, I just couldn't find a container for it. A one ounce Your container is contact pretty difficult to find. Really turn on lights. No medication for the past three days goes crazy. Only three days? Anyway. The mad, you, don't know, TOS. you don't know Mad Peak. Could you kindly say and pronounce your character's name for me real quick, just to make sure that I, I have it? Uh, the Mad INR. INR, thank you. So, Will of Apodendox. Yep. So, I don't know. You have been you have been in the martial psychiatric in, uh, institution for quite a while, and it's normally he forgot. It's normally pretty chaotic because you you exist in your mind, but today that chaos seems to have extended past your mind, and you can hear um, distantly the sounds of yelling, some thuds that you presume to be bodies dropping. Just sounds like a riot. What what will you do? Well, personally, first I'd like to sing Party Rockers. You know, the one that goes like, Party Rockers in the house tonight. Everybody's about to have a real good time. This not going to make you lose your mind. Can you put the instrumental version? Sure. Can you get that in there? I will totally. But anyway, so for... <laughs> Uh, what I would like to do is, uh, I would like to <laughs> escape. I want to go kill people. Okay. Well, looking around your cell, your cell, um, it's very barren. There isn't even a bed for you to sleep on. It's just a, a white room. No windows, one door. A little room? Sure. How do you plan on escaping? How will you attempt to escape? There's a door. Yes. Well, I mean, obviously the door is There's locked. There's a way out. Yes, I would like. I would like to begin beating against this door. Okay. <laughs> Are you still singing as you're beating? Yes. Oh yeah, I'm definitely still singing. Obviously, I'm still singing. I am still singing party rockers. Party As rock. you are beating, you are hammering away at this door, and across the hall, the hall door to the main area opens, and a man dressed in a guard's uniform, he has black like eyeshadow, his eyes are dark, and his hair has been pulled back, shaved, so it's like a mohawk with a ponytail at the end of it. And he looks, and he says, What? What are you- <laughs> That's my jam! Okay. Oh my god. How I respond? You know how I respond? I... Yeah, you want me to keep singing this shit? You gotta let me out. That's my full cell. Or no. You let me out and I keep singing for y'all. Roll persuasion. No. Oh, okay. It didn't. No. Uh, it said a one. Fuck. <laughs> six. I got a six in total. It said seven plus one. Seven minus persuasion one. Persuasion check. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, seven plus negative one. I can't count. <laughs> yeah, looks okay. at you. Yeah, the guy looks at you, and like this guy, he's dressed like a guard, but he's very clearly insane. And he's looking at you, and he says, "I've changed my mind. You're terrible at singing." Okay. <laughs> 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 oh, <God. laughs> uh, is there anything limiting the ability of me using uh one of my abilities to uh free myself? No. Oh. Um. Uh. Do you think a uh, firebolt would do anything to help me get out of here? I would like to use no. my firebolt to help me escape you can... by striking the door. Okay. Sure. We made a mistake. Which you stat would I want need to roll for that? This is... Just roll to hit firebolt, even though you're automatically hit, but I'll use this roll to, to okay. determine how effective it is. Uh. 
I can't see this shit. Okay, I got a two. You know, oh, rolled yeah. out of a d10, though. A two out of a d10? Was I supposed to use a different dice for that? Yeah, hit your plus no. one, not your damage die. Because that's just a d20. Oh, hit DC. Okay, I see that now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 16. Ah, okay, yeah. That's... Uh, so it's 17 in total. Right, so you aim at the lock of your door and you fire of a small bolt of fire and it hits and it begins melting the lock. And the guy looks up and says, and he starts screaming and runs away. Oh, I would like to chase him down. I plan on killing him for forsaking me. Okay. I have to know, are you still seeing Party, party Rock? <laughs> I think he stopped by this point to party talk to him. Okay. Um, yeah, sure. Also, you can catch up to him, so are you trying to grapple him, or are you just trying to catch up to him? What are you trying to do? Uh, first, I would just like to catch up to him. Okay. Let's see what he has to say. <laughs> he looks at you and says, uh, look, look, man, I, I, you're singing. It's great, man. You're actually wonderful. Um, I was testing you, yeah, to, to see if you'd sing more, sing better, because you're already so great. But I think you, you could do even better. I think that there's, him, there's potential. Um, would like you to be on his him, knees now. Give, give him that operatic him. version of Party Rock. Get on your knees. Oh, <laughs> intimidation. Party rockers in the house tonight. Party <laughs> rockers in the house. I got a twelve. Okay. Oh, <laughs> you did not do that. that. That's good enough. So he he, he gets down his name and says, "Please, please, please don't." I'm sorry. I'll do it. I'm see. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I. Do you. Sing. A funny Axel in Harlem song. One that goes, I put the new farties on the Jeep or I will kill you. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to roll performance for this guy. Sting it too. No. Yes. Absolutely. I'll look up a little story right now. Oh, God, you got this. Sing it and depending on what you get, Rather sing until you think he would someday. just die. <laughs> What did you get? <laughs> Dalton. I got a four. Dalton, what'd you get? Yeah, alright. Well, he gets, well, I got the new. Well, he, he gets, well. I got the new out and then dies. <laughs> so he begins to sing I'll and use it's horribly out of touch pitch. He's stuck. Chaos over his bolt words. to strike this man down mid in the middle of his speech. Song. <laughs> I got it ain't a even a song, 10 it's a speech. 10 plus 1, oh, 11 two. on the Chaos Bolt. That's good enough. He does not have much HP, so that's, I'll say that's good enough. So. Do you fucking Dr. Manhattan this man? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Osmandius! What kind of damage are you rolling to this Chaos Bolt, actually? Uh, you have to roll for the thing first, roll and then roll for the damage. D8's rolling. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's poison. What did you roll? Yeah. Six? Five, so, seven. You, you rolled you a rolled seven? Two. Oh. two D8. Three. Yeah, seven in total. Okay, so. So, psychic damage Wait, what? is what you roll. Yes. So, no, you roll, you roll, oh, no, you roll a separate D8 before you make the attack roll. Oh. Yeah, so roll and then you roll D8. two D8. For the, and for the damage, yeah. 1d8? Yes, roll 1d8 to determine to the damage the, type. To open up oh, the separate dice, it's in the bottom left. That's the damage. Left. You're determining damage type. You can click on the bottom left to get a d8. Left. Oh shit. Is that the dice one? Yeah. It is. Yeah. Oh. E8. Oh. Uh, 6. Okay, Six that, is poison. So, yeah, poison. So you fire this bolt at him, and he begins to... He, he, he begins to cough, and blood begins dripping out of his mouth, and his eyes and he stares get up at you. Kid. As they get bigger, and you say those words to him. Also folded. Easy <laughs> neg. And then he, he collapses onto the ground, dead. Ozo. 
I would now like to, uh, I don't know, what's going on around me right now? You're still in the hallway. You can hear the sounds of just chaos and yelling um, at the, uh, through the door at the end of the hallway. And there's a dead guy in front of you. Uh, I would like to, do I need to roll to eat this guy's corpse? No, <laughs> no, you can just do that. What have you? I would like to eat this guy's corpse. What I was wondering that? when that would happen. I'm so proud of you. Okay, you begin eating this guy's corpse. You know what? Roll. Are you trying to eat all of it or just some of it? Uh, I think How I'm just trying to eat his face off. Okay, <laughs> you don't have to roll anything for that. You can just eat his face. Would he get poisoned? Yay! Oh. Oh. No, he wouldn't. Why do you sound so sad? Like to go down because to the would... hall where the rest of the because I are. am. You, you reach to the end of the hall, and there are windows on the doors, and you can see you can kind of see some of what's happening. There's a few uh, guards that are like strung up and hung upside down, and they don't have their shirts on, and they're being like Beautiful. beaten with like plastic spoons because that's all they give you. <laughs> Beautiful. Um, you see, You're beaten with a plastic spoon. You see one guard who is being held up, and there are two people on one side of him and two people on the other side, and they are like playing tug of war with him. <laughs> oh, lovely! And there are people like scrawling on the walls using blood and other stuff. Um. So is it just a? What's the other do, stuff? Do, do, do I need to say it? Feces? Shit, no, they're using shit. Do. They're rubbing I shit know on what them. I would like to do. Feces. That's nice. But this is just a rare. I know exactly what I would like to do. I would like to stroll into with all these lovely people, and I would like to tell them about the truth of Abba Hindox from Beyond the Veil. Okay. What? what do you say? I love this. Open up with... What's good, my OG thugs? I know we've been here for a long time. We've been through these struggles for real, for real. I'm the gang. I'm my mama. Y'all already know what I've been saying. You know, I haven't been saying much, though. It's mostly been Apple the Hindus and that shit. He's been speaking through me and shit. And I'll be preaching. So I'm going to let him commune with me right now. And I'm going to begin talking and shit. Let him, so here we go. Let him here cook. we go. Dine on the flesh of every one of these guards. If you do... I will reward you handsomely an eternal life. Beyond I, I the veil, how delayed I reside. <laughs> and from beyond this veil, terrible, I can only face. give you a glimpse of my true I'm power. But that does not really matter at this moment in time. Through my vassal, INR here, you follow him. Anyway, back to my speech on the gang. You already know what I'm saying and shit. You already know. So that's what Abba Hindox is saying. So I'm going to tell you the niggas right now. Well, oh, this is the whoopsie daisy. Uh, anyway. Uh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Who are you? Okay, but anyway, so what up? It's so beautiful. What I was saying was, y'all, Abba the Hindox, what he been saying, we need to start eating these people. They deserve it. They've been keeping us here and shit. Like, this shit's not right. We need to eat these motherfuckers. You already know what I'm saying? I don't do it. Okay? Okay? That's what I'm saying. I, I feel like you would have to roll persuasion to go over I what I'm doing at this moment. Yeah. Please yeah. roll persuasion for me. Persuasion. With, I'll say with advantage, because I feel you should get inspiration for that. <laughs> Just so <laughs> Jesus. It's the advantage. Roll so twice. Just roll it twice take the highest. and take roll the bigger twice, number. Take the roll highest. Twice. Persuasion. Uh, fifteen. What's the other one? Fourteen. Can I take the fifteen? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so that's high enough to where you see. Fifteen. Uh, quite a few people begin like, like yeah, he's he's real. He's he's kind. Of, he's right. We should. He's preaching some facts. At least one one inmate, one bald inmate who has like scars all over his body, just goes. One, he's one of the ones that are pulling the um. He's got like the guard by the arm and is like tug of war him, and he just starts biting into his arm. Nice. 
But beautiful. While you've convinced some, uh, there is one man. He has a helmet on. And he has like a visor, and he's dressed like a guard. And he says, "I don't appreciate your false god. My eyes have been opened. The father told I me of like the to great." I would like to cut him off and slay him where he stands with a firebolt. Okay. For none shall deny the truth okay. of the Lord Abba Hendox. Roll to hit. <laughs> Fuck! I got a six. I'm dead. I'm seven. <laughs> <laughs> that face. Can you make that face again? <laughs> this can't. Be oh. <laughs> oh my god. You oh a fireball appears in your hands and you throw it and it misses and just hits the wall behind. That was a warning fuck. shot, you know. Yeah, that's exactly what I say. That shit. Hey, hey, young blood. Listen, that was a warning shot. If you want me to hit you, I'll kill your ass where you stand right now. I'll kill your ass. Not even with no weapons or shit. None of my magic is. Shit. None of that happened to hit nice gifts. I come over there and I whoop your ass. I whoop your ass. I whoop your ass hard. And I whoop your ass till you're dead. You know? You start listening to what I'm saying. Or I'm gonna kill you. Roll that shit was a warning shot. I'm gonna be nice. I'm so God, proud of the chaos you're causing. What is going on in charisma. this session? It's such, such, Magic. Such. It's exactly, exactly 18, what 18, I thought 18, would happen. 18, 18, 19, 19 plus. <laughs> <laughs> the man looks at you, and though you can't see his eyes because of the visor, he's clearly shaken, and he says, I, I am the prophet. These are my followers. And we won't forget this. And he turns around and he tries to run away. <clears throat> I'm just so Let proud him run of away, because I know one day we'll turn to the truth. And now that I've getting, convinced all these people to begin eating the guards, as they should, it's a very good thing to do. When bodies have a sufficient amount of calories within them. Anyway, I would like to leave this place. I would like to begin purging the town. Okay. <laughs> so you stroll out the front door, covered in blood. Uh, Yay! You do notice to uh, you're in the courtyard area before the uh, the fence. There's like a forty uh, twenty five foot uh, walkway between the entrance and a gate, and there's a courtyard area in between. And to your right is the is a couple of corpses. <laughs> Not uh, my fault. <laughs> <laughs> definitely not my fault. To eat them. I think I want to eat them. I think I want to eat them. I I I was merely present at the scene when they murdered each other, Your Honor. <laughs> I need to roll to consume I, I their bodies. I my shit, girly pop, not. and they killed each other. <laughs> Are you trying to eat them? God, whole? I can just like all of them. No, I'm just I'm ripping not. their faces off and eating them. Mm. This is even more horrifying when you know what he looks like. <laughs> what does what a he's like a dog person he's like a like a, uh, yeah a tabaxi is like a cat person uh, he, he's a mongrel folk it was either a knoll or it was a wolf and i forgot which one i ended up choosing mm -hmm. it's his custom it's his custom lineage yep so it's so save it then. yeah it's a knoll. terrifying looking i think that Wait, makes a knoll. very sharp teeth I'm imagining like a dachshund. <laughs> dachshund. Personally, I'm, like, no, I'm it's imagining a little more than that. Yeah. Just a Pomeranian on a human body. Sufficient. <laughs> like not a Pomeranian head, like a full Pomeranian starting at the neck. Just. Yeah. yeah it's yeah. like a reverse Pomeranian. Pomeranian <laughs> yeah, like a human body and then just the dog on top. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> that is deeply disturbing. Do his arms stick out in front of his torso? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> is he like a? Is he like a Jiangxi? Uh, I think I've received oh. from the outer god, from beyond the veil. I am meant for something more. To search some people, 
search for some people who can help me on my quest. Oh no. I think the warfare is like, this is normally when like my brain would go, you hear like your god say this or that, but I genuinely can't fathom the way you commune with your god or what your god would ever <laughs> say. Just howling at each other. Just tell him what you just need not know. His, just, just give him like the like the, the talking points for his god, and he'll fill out the rest. It's just howling. You can already actually yeah. talk Hello, to this Hello, god. Check. Okay, this is based on howling, real yeah. life. Um, <laughs> this episode. Escape the ward to be here. Be your discretion is advised. <sighs> Is that the only, is that the episode name? Did you just drop the episode name? It might be. <laughs> it might have to be. I might legally need to make that the name. A new challenger has approached. <laughs> okay, so you got I, I don't even know how to like describe this genuinely. Give you you do see flashes, images of people. Just do it. One very large man, tan skin black hair, one very short, fully armored figure, one um, mushroom person. I'm imagining mushroom. this like Smash Bros style, like they're just covered in shadow. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the photograph of Dio's badge. <laughs> Jojo. <laughs> yeah, sure. You know what? Let's, let's say that. You can't make out really like the, the facial details, but you can you can see the the outlines of these figures. One tiefling, and one creature Dude, with your character oh, really long antenna. That's exceptionally small. I see. I see. And you can feel my god. I it. see that you've been telling me. I see what you've told me from beyond the veil and shit. I'm gonna go find these mofos. What you need me to do? Oh my god. <laughs> well, got DM. I am regressing. <sighs> god. I'm regretting joining this. Regret. I gave you this is the greatest. This is the greatest. We've only been doing We've this We've only like been doing minutes. this for like, what, 40? Yeah, 20 or 30 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Not this long is, at This is already the greatest. Oh my god. Mother just sent me. Yeah, I sent you and, and <laughs> I sent so Clayton beautiful. and That's Dalton the same DM. If I remember, I'll throw it up. Now you either just saw it or you didn't, because mm. I'm I'm so inconsistent with actually following through on that. I'll everybody else too. I don't mind. Nah. Anyway, meow, meow, been told to do a little trolling. Meow, meow, meow. What do I find these people? <laughs> You can kind of feel them, like almost like you can smell them, but and yet you've never smelled them before, and you can follow them. Looks like immediately begin running on all fours towards oh. wherever these people may be, no matter how far the distance. Mm. I remain on all fours, running towards them. I'm sorry. <laughs> what? Mm, no. <laughs> Have you guys seen the image? <laughs> it's, oh, it's beautiful. Yes. It's so beautiful. It's, it's so beautiful. It's amazing. <laughs> I hate it. Yeah, I hate it. it. Your character it looks my like. Character. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. I love that they're on the same level of pixelated. It I'm basically one... it literally looks like that the person's head is in the dog. What That's was what the it. cat's name from SAOA? Was it Fluffles? Fluffles. Yeah. Fluffles. I'm, thinking, I'm, I'm thinking of Fluffles. <laughs> so you begin running on all fours through this city. Um, occasionally you'll run by someone and they'll like scream in terror. And eventually, your search is why, galloping but... on camera right now. Bro, he is legitimately running through the streets <clears throat> on all fours. <laughs> uh, eventually, your search leads you to a small inn with a, a hanging sign that, while it doesn't say the name of the inn, it has a small crescent moon on it, and you can feel your targets are inside. 
I enter Target. quietly and normally, walking on two legs like a normal person because I'm completely normal and completely <laughs> sane. On my Am I still in a straight jacket? Feet. Am I still in a straight jacket? Yes. You never said you took it off. <laughs> I mean, obviously, <laughs> to run on all fours, I would have had to yeah. break the constraints. You're obviously but, still. You know, that's no real in, feat. It, you're still in your um, like your patient's outfit. I'm like the paper pants. Yeah. <laughs> paper clothing. <laughs> he comes in. He's in like. <laughs> I would like to find one who looks like a fish. Oh, you no. have many plans. No! 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 no. no. You no. cry to the I fish. I am going fish. to the fish. I am I going to do the why? fish. As you begin Dead. walking in, why? you are the, briefly a um a young woman behind the the counter of like the reception area. will look and say, "Oh, um, do you have do 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 you want a room? We have oh, some woman, available." Do not speak to me. I am here on a quest. I have been sent here by my god to find a certain group of people. You will not stop me. Don't be a hero. Don't try to be a hero. <laughs> I, was okay. waiting for that. I was waiting for that. I knew that was going to come out. I knew he was going to say that. Roll intimidation. With advantage, probably. Oh. With advantage. <laughs> Alright, what is you can't keep giving Clayton Why advantage. He needs to stop being so good, good at this. Why do you want to specifically covered in blood, and these are the words he's he rolled an 18. 18. Right? Yeah. 18. He's covered in blood. <laughs> Why are you having to torture specifically me? Why me? Yes, her. Hey, you don't know. She could. He, he could find Velvet <laughs> first. He smells like fish. The woman screams he's and getting, runs away. What, what do I? What do you think I smell like fish? I'll be you said that in episode 6. So, real quick, a little pause. No. I'd like to real quick talk about yeah, the, the sleeping arrangements. So, does everyone have their own individual rooms, or have you paired up? What is the, what's the situation? I will sleep under Well, I'm kind of just talking with someone because, specifically, Khaldun for some reason, because I can't leave the vicinity of his face for I no reason. Out. Don't. Don't. I am passed out in the middle of the floor in the hallway. That's lovely. I don't think I think we all have one room, but it's somehow I feel I'm... like Khaldun and a posse fought to see who would who would sleep with Tay. No no Why? no. How damp or moist is the underside of the bed here? It's just it's disgusting. Oh, like mold that's growing and shit. That's me! I'm going to join my brethren! Hello, We're going to sleep family back. tonight. What's happening? <laughs> so, I am... If I all sleep I think in the I'm hallway. the only one who is on the bed. <laughs> and the rest are in a room? Yeah. I sleep on the bed. the fish. I yeah, smell I think her. A posse's... I think a posse's under the bed, and there's Something two beds. Something smells fishy. I have one bed, and Aldoon and Isla are on the other bed, and... Ephrael's outside. And I'm sleeping under Velfi. <laughs> okay. So as you walk up these wooden stairs creaking under you, this is clearly a very old building, you see a figure sleeping in the hallway covered in armor, and you can feel the rest are in the room behind it. <laughs> I'd like to awake this creature covered in armor. I want to speak to them. Okay. It's the smell of the That's fish. That's gonna end badly. Israel, you are awoken by a, a tall. Is your character tall? I don't actually know how tall your character is. She's not oh, that. Like they're tall. very tall and scraggly. Oh, are you talking about? Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah, very tall. Wow. I see. Tall. Hey, bloody fluffy oh, man! Scrawny. They look like Trevor Resnick. The tallest, the tallest person you have ever seen, ever. Taller than Calhoun. Oh. How tall? How tall? Like nine Calhoun? feet. A staggering seven foot one. Nice. I'm the NBA star. <laughs> LeBron James. <laughs> Is that you? <laughs> He's wearing his signature outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Paper pants. 
Okay. I thought we were implying LeBron James was a furry for a second. No. <laughs> LeBron James reportedly spotted howling at the moon says he needed to he says Slavic lives matter <laughs> <laughs> Slavic lives matter oh my god that image, that image. oh my god so there's oh, an exceptionally only, tall only he man standing before you uh, hello um tall fluffy bloody man what can I do for you today? Well, this isn't any man, though. This isn't any man. Well, that's what she's referring you to. So as soon as it. soon as I see the blood on him, can I sense her good and evil? Well, look, I need to download YouTube Kids on my phone so I can keep my sister away. I'm sorry, Gabe. You want to what? He I'm said going sense to good sense evil. good and oh. evil. Sure, I'm a completely be. normal person. I'm completely sane. So, I'm a human. I am normal human. What do I see, Dalton? Um, God, I don't... The problem is, I don't know what his god is classified as. Oh no, I well, was just thinking of the screen and he's he's not really benevolent. Well, what, nor is, is he... what is he himself is classified as? Well he himself he's not good be and he's not detected evil. by good and evil, it only detects Fae, undead, and fiends. But I don't know what this god would be classified as. Obviously he is um He said neither good he said neither good nor evil, so wouldn't it be like a grey mist? Yeah. Eldritch. You don't, you don't detect anything particular about this creature. So, um, what's up? What's up, bro? What's up, bro? <laughs> I love the height. I would like, like to greet people. this lovely man. You dare misgender the goblin? <laughs> Oh, no. oh, good sir. I smell a fish in this room. Yes. Uh... Right for something like this happen. Hmm. Oh, the firefish. The firefish. Right. Yeah, she is not a firefish. Right ahead. In fact, Why? and I'm and I'm just I'm gonna like open the door for him and usher him in. Why? <laughs> Why? Gabriel character. <laughs> Welcome back, Don. How been? How been, Don? I'm back. You doing good? You doing good and shit? I hope you've been doing fine. Harper. I saw you froze your camera. Rings, bro, bring it up. You know that work. Okay. okay. Dalton, you look. Okay. You're... You look just fine, Dalton. <laughs> You I just had to abandon my right sister, right. so she's basically home alone. Okay, sorry about that. My power went out. Oh. 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 <laughs> we're back. Did the recording save? Oh yeah, Did we're fine. Yeah, I, okay. Right. Computer backup. How can you talk to them? How, no, what? Okay, so when we last... Flashbacks to the first episode. Mm -hmm. so, oh. So... What happened, Landon? Also, Taylor, I, I don't. Name. I don't plan to do anything evil to you. I plan to simply place you in a yeah, bucket. Yeah, Ephrael uh, pointed not... the mad Ionar to our door. Yes. No was... placing me in a bucket. Yeah. Opened it for yeah, I was him. Say, little more than that. I should have hit inside. Clayton, I swear, if you place me in a bucket, I will beat the living you... crap out of well, you. You can't. <laughs> Taylor, you're getting eaten. <laughs> so. You walk into this Clay room, this dark becoming... room, there are two beds, one window in the, the middle. Crap out of me in person. On one bed We're sleeps a blue tiefling. And do either and either. And on the other bed sleeps a large man and a very, very small girl. Rim. Now if this was Lolita, we'd be in trouble. Why do you have to mention Ooh. Lolita? What happened to Dalton? Why is Dalton doing this? I don't know. 
It's okay. Oh, Dalton, Every Dalton, Dalton, Dalton hail the blue fumes, Dalton, no. Dalton, you can tell the blue is spreading. Dalton, no. Oh, 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 oh. I'm sure, I'm sure something really funny is happening to my camera right now. But much like our no, viewers, really. I can't see it. Not really. Hmm. You're a little bit better. Lagging horribly. Oh, I can finally hear you guys now. Oh, okay, I'm starting to become pixelated as well. Um, what what did I miss in like the past five minutes? Because I couldn't hear anyone. Not much. Not much. Okay. Nothing, Nothing really. actually. All I heard, the last thing I heard was entering the room. All right, you enter the room, and there oh. it's a it's a small, simple room, two beds, uh, a window between them, on the floor wall. In one bed to your right sleeps a blue tiefling, and on the bed to your left sleeps an incredibly large man, though not as tall as you, and a very very short girl with antenna. Is there a bucket in this room? Roll no. Perception or investigation. Where's my stuff in the room? Investigation. Probably under the bed with you. Maybe. I Thank you God I have that, a like, plus two in investigation. It's up to you where it is. Uh, <laughs> this is about to be easy. Alright, I got a 12 plus two, 14. Okay. Fourteen. So, searching on. So, where would your stuff be, actually? Just poking out from under the bed because it's so big, it can't fit with me. It doesn't take long for you to well, notice that there is a very large bag and bucket and stuff just poking out from under the bed that the tiefling is sleeping in. Yeah. Smells of corpses. And it very smells sink. horrible. Probably good to you because it smells like a corpse, but. Yes, because I love corpses. I love consuming flesh. There's like, is there a cheese to just stuff. like? Could I just cheese Taylor and just like put her in a bucket and then drink her and steal her? <laughs> no, no. She is still like ten inches. I, I mean, I don't know this. if you can drink the glizzy, but like, go I, for it. Man. I, I already <laughs> went over this. Yeah, the forbidden glizzy. And the, no, the forbidden, the forbidden smoothie no. is what I went over. No. Oh. <laughs> Using no. my strength score of no. twenty to blend her up in a glass bottle with my bare hands. <laughs> No. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, I would just like the bucket, and is there a sink in this room? Well, the bucket is filled already. Yeah, as you pull the bucket, with... it is filled with a silvery goo. Oh, no. I'd like to pour this Don't on the sleeping it, fish woman. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Your life. I would like you to roll a sleight of hand to, to determine how board. stealthily you can move <laughs> and do this. Don't do it, Clayton. And you Don't have to be oh my God. her passive Does perception. Pass my passive perception. I'm oh, better roll an eight, ten. So I got ten. Dad, help me. Okay, what is, I, what is Isla's passive? That's Isla's or mine. Well, who are you? he's pouring it on Isla, isn't he? Wait, yeah, yeah, but he doesn't he have to take it from Richard? Yeah, he has to take it from me then first. He, he has to... <laughs> sure. I mean, what's your passive perception? Twelve. Well, he, he, he missed both of them, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> so you both awaken to this... Mm. <clears throat> very Would good... I also notice this? Uh, what's your passive perception? Probably. Twelve. Yeah. <laughs> Who awakens? Velfie, what's your everyone notice? Like everyone, because yeah, because Velfie definitely has a high right. So you all awaken to this, and it's dark. There's like no like like lamps on or anything. So just like, this tall right now. shadow. Mm. Oh. oh Reaching for the bucket, and attempting to seal it. I don't know why, but no. every time I think about Clayton's character now, oh, no. all I can think about is like the Twilight soundtrack. So all I'm hearing right now is do 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 do. You're a monster. I would like to immediately explain myself, and I would like to do it in character. That's good with y'all, gang. I came here because oh, the god Abba the Hindox from Beyond the Veil has told me that I need to find y'all because you will help me on my quest. And our our fates have entwined together through the will of Abba Hindox. I don't plan to do anything bias to you guys. I do not plan to consume you. I do not. I do not. Never. Sure. Eating people is bad. Sure. Sure. Uh, 
<laughs> sure. You sure. Been almost eaten on multiple occasions. You don't know I what. also have. Please repeat. Your mic cut out. <clears throat> You see, I don't believe that because I've been almost eaten on multiple occasions. I also have. Oh, you see, I am a carnivore. I eat flesh. I do not eat mushroom. Fair enough. You don't get the bucket, though. That's my bucket. My bucket full of drugs. Our bucket. Right. Full of drugs. Full of drugs. Our bucket. Full of drugs. My friends. My newly appointed drugs. friends. It's my bucket. Excuse me. The drugs inside are all of ours, but it's my bucket. I traverse with you upon your quest. Uh, who's trust him? I believe are you we will find my skills of great use. Are we listen to Galdoon. I don't trust him. Dune is your name. I don't know what you're talking you about. Trust this is me. a completely trustworthy fellow. Who I'm is given... this? Abada Hendox, you speak of. He is the all benevolent master. He loves all that is good, except for tieflings and elves. No knife ears. We don't like them. <laughs> Based. Wait. Who? <laughs> Based. Why do you Wait. say that like a style Wait. meter call out? <laughs> I take out a book and start like jotting something down. But <laughs> um, me and Apostle just look at each other like, uh, um, <laughs> there's some elf in me, so I'm a little worried now. That's song. Oh, don't just, worry. Uh, you don't appear as a knife ear, so I do not dislike you. Oh, okay. And I do not have the same extent of racism as Abba the Hendox does. I am actually all inclusive. As long as you are made of flesh, I'm just afraid in general, you. you're a lot but, but it's made of mushroom. You just said He's you're a carnivore. Equal. <laughs> He's an as, equal. And because um, you are made of mushroom, I will not eat you. Mm, um, you have nothing to be afraid of. Racist. I do not like plant. F fair. Um, you, your, your fish you, friend looks quite scrumptious. No. 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 Do not speak to me or my daughter ever again. I mean, I don't really like the shrimp that much. If I'm being honest. You were honest. thinking that it was about assaulting your daughter in any sort of way. No, it was not. It was about actually eating mm, your sure. daughter. I would like to consume sure, her. However, I will I not have to give express aware. permission. Sure, it wasn't. That's great. Haldun, I don't trust him. I don't want to be anywhere near this man. Mm. Please. I, I trust this weird creature explicitly. If you allow I, me to travel with you, I will head first jump into any any danger that comes in your way, I will gladly take the fall for the rest of you. Can I, can I tell how, like, physically fortuitous he is? Roll an insight check. What does that mean? I, like, I know I'm not the one rolling it, but what does I that mean? I got a mean? 17. I'm kind of doing <laughs> so, you're just, like, sizing him up? Yeah. You can tell from what he he's surprisingly like hardy, like firm, but he is pretty weak, like physically. Mm. Reverse class cannon, and he's threatening my life. Oh, I didn't threaten your life. He doesn't look very well armed either. That I would eat you. Unlike the short one. Yeah, I have. You did I too my threaten my life. Thank you. Clues. I did not threaten your life. I just threatened to consume you. That is threatening my life. No, there can be I... non-lethal war. There's non-lethal <laughs> war. I've seen plenty of that. I've seen enough of non-lethal war. I've been consumed before. I fought covetous <laughs> demon. God. Anyway, I've been consumed you, before. Still, you alive. do not seem to bring much physical value. Ah, mm. uh, yeah. That is. Because I have given up much of my physical prowess in the form of gaining a deep understanding of Manvin's many people to do my bidding. Because I am a very convincing person, both through my magics and through my speech. Oh, huh. I still don't trust you. I think, I think we, should, we should keep this person. This is... No. 
Yeah. I don't yeah. trust him. I, I don't trust him. I don't trust are you him. implying that you are a magician? What is it? No, I just don't trust him. There's a difference. Not you. Is it because he's a magician, Ira? Are you are you magicianist? <laughs> it's Isla, thank you. I don't care. You're a, you're a shrimp to me. Yeah, and you're a fungus. So how do you want how do you the, like that? How do you want the food prepared? Sushi roll? Uh, <laughs> no. I think no. No. <laughs> Caldoon, stop uh, her. She's trying to convince him to eat me. I think Clayton's been decommed. Has he? It looks like it. At least he's, like, doing something right now. Clayton's video is dark. It's always dark. It has only been his beautiful smile. Bra Bravo, going quiet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gabe, pause this point. <laughs> what Carly, are you doing, Carly? Gabe? Get it, get it. Hey, 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 Go, go, give us nothing. Um, I guess we just continue on. Clayton's kind of... Mid-sentence, how do we continue on yeah. from that? Yeah. Um... What'd he say? Yeah, that's... I don't know what he said. I'd like to think that ever since he said the thing about elf ears, Wolfie has just <laughs> covered her ears with her hair. Um... What do you mean? It's your character. It's not, I'd like to think about it. It's she does it. Huh? 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 Um, no. oh! Whoa. Whoa. There he is. Oh, please, I can no longer play. I have oh. to uh, take care of my sister. Oh, no. I'm being a, a present brother, a present figure within her life. And it is in this, I find great regret. Uh, what happened? Did you guys end up accepting me into the clan? Am I a part of phase? Your mid sentence. I assume you're a hallucination that just appears and disappears at random. Yeah, I pretty much do not trust you and you think were, you're gonna eat. You were talking about your magical abilities. I'm willing to prepare Isla for your sushi roll. So, uh, Dalton. And I say, Kaldun, please stop her. Yeah. You think okay, it's so pretty funny I do if he just actually disappears. Got to go <laughs> now. I will see y'all later, bro. Alright, okay. see ya. That was actually I think pretty it... fun. I had lots of fun. I'm looking forward to playing more. Hopefully I think it'd be. I think it'd be really funny if he just appears and disappears into existence at random. Oh yeah. Right. Okay. So. <laughs> and he's that, speaking that of his magical prowess, and he's 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 discussing how great he is at magic. When suddenly a dark inky pool opens beneath him, and it begins to, to cocoon around him. He lowers <laughs> his cocoon, and he is. Is gone. he still talking? Wow. Yeah, as he's speaking, he's is like, he still like, like oh, it's coming oh, up? And he's like, oh yeah, I'm just I'm the best there ever was. And then he sings, and he you just hear him. You know that's how you know because I I I know everything about magic. Like there's a boy on your whole lap. I don't trust him. <laughs> no, 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 no. It closes and begins singing. He's there. <laughs> there truly oh, were party rockers in that, that house tonight. An <laughs> inky black pool opens up and you hear muffled caramel dancing coming from it. <laughs> the pool gets smaller and smaller until it disappears. Do we continue? Uh, we continue now from where we left. I assume I assume we well, just act as if nothing me, happened. Me, me, me. That's up to you, man. <laughs> I am going to act as I if nothing happened. You question me about it, nothing happened. Back under the bed that for me. That was interesting. I don't trust it. I was all scared now. Find... I'll have to find. Because someone threatened that they can make me into food. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Hey, he was already gonna eat you. I was just offering a nice preparation. 
You don't offer preparations. Listen, we don't like each other. <laughs> exactly, but you don't offer me up. You've almost killed me, like several, like all of us, several times. I'll okay, do it again. Both of you, Dalton. Both like, times you. Like, if you had to estimate. I want to say. I really want to just say that I was like really, really up close to her face because it's funny. It's pretty late at night. Um, like, well, not actually. At this point, you've been asleep for maybe an hour or two, so it's mm. like it's like a short uh, rest. Yeah. You've okay, got, you've definitely, you guys have definitely gotten a short rest. If you haven't already long rested oh, from the you. thing. I go back under bed. Both I'm gonna go look around the town at night. Right, one more Ooh, thing. Yeah. It's night time. Oh, Belfi, would you <laughs> yeah. please? Oh, please. Oh, no. Do me do me a favor. Do me a quick quick solid, if you would. You know, just... Just help me out here. Just do me. A, I'm just. I just need a little. One little roll. One tiny little. Fucking bandaid up. <laughs> one tiny little. Okay, I got a. Roll. I got a nat twenty. Okay, nice. come on. You're fine. <laughs> you say the same today for some reason. I was so. I was just so distracted. I was so distracted, and I was just like, huh. Oh right, forgot. I have like can't be. <laughs> like, I mean, I'm a werewolf and I have a curse that <laughs> let's go explore I want to go nighttime terrorism okay. I really can't so, I can't don't. believe I'm out walking the streets right okay. what do what? I see lay it on me on the on the on the cobbled path <laughs> on the corner what? waiting for a john you begin walking through the cobbled straight up jorking it and this is where it becomes very clear that like no. The difference between a town and a city. Because a town would be, like, totally dark. But there are, like, magical lights illuminating, like, the corners of uh, streets. And there are a few people drunkenly stumbling about. Uh, it just feels very alive. Um, there's, like, a... There's, there's a man there with a his tie... T there's a man with his tie wrapped around his head vomiting in, in an alleyway. Um, Ugh. Um, and as you pass by an alleyway, a small, short man, hunched over, walks out. Says, "Hey, you!" And he's honestly, he's a little taller than you. He goes, "Hey, that's some nice armor you got." He's rubbing his hands together. <laughs> uh huh. I'm a I'm a businessman, you see, and I got mm -hmm. a business proposition. For you, friend. I'm gonna be silent and still listen. Please follow me into my office. He, <laughs> and he walks into the alleyway. I guess I'm following him to his office. <laughs> you, you walk into this alleyway, and the man keeps walking, and he has a small cardboard box flipped upside down. That he's using like a table. He sits behind it and says, Holy shit. Impressive. <laughs> Chosen. <laughs> yes. You see, I'm in I'm in a special kind of business. I'm in removals and surfaces. I remove things, clean things. <laughs> Clothing. I remove oh, the filth. Uh, while the you're doing this, I'm gonna go get some food. Like in real life or in the game? Real life. <laughs> I guess that answered that. Dalton, Dalton, I have yes? a question. Does this city have a sewer system? Probably. Perfect. It's a city. <laughs> I'm going to wait my turn. I was just asking a question. <laughs> what do you mean, does the city have a sewer system? <laughs> I need to know about it, okay? For it's a city, of course it has a sewer system. No. Not always true. Not always true, Gabe. Can't always I don't want to hear that shit from you, Taylor. Anyway, Dalton. 
Continue. So he, he's rubbing his hands together and he's looking at you and he says, Would you say that you're a um a woman of means? Can you get things done? Are you talented? Are you skilled? Absolutely. You have no idea how skilled I can be. Perfect. Or maybe you do. After uh, all, you called me in for your alley. Yes, your no, office here. Yes, thank you. Your office alley. I need you to do me a favor. I need no a job. We I, I presumed our friendship and I'm sorry about that. Friends ask for favors, but I I am offering you a job with pay. And you'll never get us. I'm gonna pay you something special. Money. That's right. Holy good money. googly moogly. Money. I just need you to do one thing. And he, he lifts up, he's got this like dirty, ratty brown coat. And he lifts it up and he reaches inside of it. And he pulls out a small square box and he says what i need you to do is i need you to find there's a there's there's sorry there's a there's an inn nearby and he pulls out two more boxes there's an inn and there's an office a post office and there is a hospital and i need you and there i'm a, i see i uh I need to deliver these these packages to them. No, 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 no. Need to get the word around, don't you? Yeah, I'm trying to expand, you know? Fear not, I am just the person you needed to ask. I'll get it done for you, sir. Thank you so much. I can't wait. Gabe's the terrorist. It's so beautiful. Come and back. I I am going to get bad at a local bath happen? and body works by the end of this session. <laughs> oh no. When you get bad, champagne bath and body toast works. will no right, longer don't. be champagne. So, uh, let's see. I'm going to have to roll. What was it? Hang on. What's my memory? Okay, yeah, I don't remember a single thing he said. <laughs> you just have to <laughs> you'll, you'll check <laughs> if if you'll if you'll Wait, check the uh, roll log. <laughs> I, uh, you roll <laughs> to remember negative. something? Someone... Holy shit! <laughs> I, I don't remember it all. You roll to remember something someone just said to you. <laughs> exactly. You didn't, you didn't, sure. Okay, so now you have three gray small boxes. So I vaguely, because he just told me, I vaguely remember I need to take these boxes somewhere. I heard hospital, post office, and inn. I have no clue if that's right. I'm a think that's right. I don't know if they're at these boxes. I'm just gonna chuck that. You know what? Okay, first stop. Which one's closest? Um, well, the first one would probably be the inn, since you the only inn in town you know of is the one you're coming from. Okay. I am going to walk back to the inn. Okay. So are the rest of you still at the inn? <laughs> no. Oh yeah, I know. Oh, you no. just got back. What did I miss? Oh no! <laughs> Don't worry about it. Gabe has went into an alleyway, <laughs> and now uh, he's going to probably do something to the inn. So he's gonna. Nice. He's becoming a terrorist. I am in. Ted. Ka- I I am become Ted Kaczynski. Uh, he basically a became bomber. Isla, but without intentionally becoming. Isla. <laughs> you just called yourself a terrorist. Wow. <laughs> anyway. I'm going to go to this inn, and, you know, I've heard the tales of Santa bringing gifts to children. Does this inn have a fireplace, Dalton? (laughs) Does this inn have a chimney? Sure. I am going to clamber my way on top to reach this chimney and drop this package down the chimney. (laughs) Just like old St. Nicholas, who I admire. Do you... Drop it, or do you go down the chimney? I just chuck that shit in, and I'm on my way. Okay. <laughs> I would like for you to roll a perception check. 
Perception, perception, perception. Where is perception? There it is. Ten. That's enough. Um, <laughs> you, you, hear, you hear a man who, like, you, you hear when, like, it hits. There's no fire going at all right now, but it hits the ground. And you hear a man, like, huh? You can kind of hear like some ruffling, rustling, and then you hear him scream out and yell, "Why are there wasps? <laughs> <laughs> Who puts wasps down a chimney?" <laughs> you know what, Dalton? <laughs> After seeing that, I'm I'm not going to I'm not going to take the, I'm not going to bring the rest to the other places. No, I'm just I keep okay. them on me. You like wasps? <laughs> That's why I'm keeping them on me. Actually, wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I have an idea. I have an idea. I like wasps. Everybody else should like wasps as much as I do. I am going to spread the gift of wasps to the townspeople. Goodness. Next stop, no. the hospital. <laughs> okay. I am going to merrily trot my way down to the hospital. This feels like more of a me thing. It was just a prank. It's just a prank. Yeah, it's just a prank, bro. I hope you realize. But now you're, you're making it serious. Within the span of like 12 hours. We are going to be annihilating four institutions of an entire <laughs> of an entire town. Yeah. Yes. Only one of them is going to be caused by land. <laughs> <laughs> and most of them are going to be All right, caused. Then. Have I made it to the hospital yet? Quick pause. <laughs> Quick pause on that. <laughs> Richly. Yeah. I'm aware you also want to do something. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna I also wanted to do something, but I don't know if I can leave. <laughs> no, you can't. So. Mm -hmm. Richly, what yeah. do you wish to do? I want to explore the sewers, please. We okay. please. Boo -boo. Oh, the no. chair we on top. God damn. Okay. You, do you have dark vision? Yes. Okay, just want to make sure. So. You begin. It's it's one of those TV sewers, so it's very spacious. Mm, nice. And it smells terrible. Beautiful. And I'd like you to roll a perception check. Oh great! Oh. <laughs> uh, this one. Ah, that's great. Six. <laughs> Mm. Dart vision doesn't do that, but I don't use my eyes. I'm sorry. I just looked in the roll log. When did Gabriel roll a negative two? Yeah, I just <laughs> thought you were gone. <laughs> Anyways, um, he's in fact not jocking on him. So you rolled a a six, or I use a. You can use a lucky dice. Re Yay! That. I'm gonna reroll that. Oh, I pray, hope and pray. I'm gonna have to start using my own dice because recently this D and D Beyond has not been kind to me. That's never kind. Gabriel has. Gabriel has no choice. That's a twenty-one. Yeah. What do you 21. mean I have no choice? Perfect. I have physical dice. You yeah, hear, and they're both bad. <laughs> you, you, as you're trudging through the sewer, you hear a low growl. Oh, that's good. Ah, oh, and... fuck, it's INR. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, bad already, huh? And you can kind of see about 20... No, actually, a good distance away. How, how far is your... um? 60. 60. So about, uh, yeah, about 50 feet away from you. The the uh the shit water, <laughs> the shit that vaguely resembles water, um, mm. is not moving the way it should, as if something's in it. Oh, that's fun. This is where we meet the that's teenage <laughs> teenage mutant ninja turtles. Teenage mutant ninja turtles. Um, does it seem the one from the live action one? Oh, you mean. 
You mean legally distinct kung fu? Uh... <laughs> kung fu frogs. Kung fu frogs, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, shit, no, that's Battletoads. Uh, <laughs> uh, um, tortoises. Minor amphibious beings of non explicit, non distinct martial arts. <laughs> Young adult yes. evolved kung fu tortoises. <laughs> Does it seem malevolent at all? Rings a bell. Roll nature. Yay, nature. I got a 20. Um, <laughs> that's high enough to know this be a sewer gator. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Incredibly territorial animals. Cool. So oh. Gabriel's delivering wasps. <laughs> I have plans, Landon. And Richley's <laughs> wrestling gators in the sewers. Well, may I be Florida? able to try and leave? May I try to leave? Can I try and of leave and explore? Can. Give me a moment. Hey. Well, um, does she have to roll anything to get past Khaldun? She has to yeah, roll something fair. to get past the wasps. <laughs> no, Khaldun. <laughs> you guys are trapped with the wasp. Do I know what time it is? Mm. You'd, you'd be able to... I mean, yeah, it's about 11 if you had a guess. I, I, I have the wanderer thing. <clears throat> oh, yeah, we Young all took lady. feats. Oh, wait, would I still be able to... Uh, yeah. Uh, well, it depends. Caldin, are you attempting to prevent her from leaving? Young lady. Do you know what? what time it is? Yes, time for me to explore. That is what time it is. It is approximately 11 p.m. Everyone else is outside. Why can't I be? Do you L listen to them buzzing and cheering. For you to go outside? <laughs> Yes. The answer is yes. Mm. But I am going to have to ask you to be back by two. Fine. And then I throw her in a lecture my... piece. <laughs> There's your allowance. <laughs> okay. You really just are her dad. Okay. I have money. Okay. Go, go have fun. <laughs> you have to remember, cool. Isla has a sugar daddy already. Cool, I'm gonna go now. Anyway. Goodbye. If you're not back by two, I will find you. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 Or have out. fun. <laughs> Have a good day. Hey Dalton. Okay. Yes. So I have currently been going to the hospital, right? I assume yes. hospitals don't have chimneys. They do not, typically. Can you So sadly I am going to have to, as Santa does, chuck one of these wasp boxes through the window. <laughs> no, not are these windows the window. reinforced? Walk in from the front door, casually walk into the front door and just sit it down. That's just no, a... but that's like not the Santa thing to do. I'm <laughs> wasp Santa. You don't understand. <laughs> wasp. wasp. Wow. <laughs> Can that be actual wasp Santa? Just Santa, Santa, but a wasp. Santa okay, wasp. Dalton. Wasp. Can I chuck? Wasp. Can I chuck one of these wasp boxes through a window? Sting, Nick. Roll a split <laughs> check. <laughs> okay. What did you get? Was Does a 14, 14 make it? I'll tell you... I'll tell you what it does do. You throw... Hospitals do typically have wait, reinforced... Wait, 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 wait. Actually, yeah. Can someone look up okay. the... On the class of glass? It's 13. Oh my, oh my god. <laughs> I don't believe it. I can't believe it. Genuinely. Wow. 
Gabriel only gets good rolls when it's something stupid. Be free, <laughs> little ones! <laughs> Be free! <laughs> and that's referring to, like, a glass-like block, so a pain should not be hard to go through. <laughs> you throw... <laughs> you, you chuck this box, and it crashes through the window. And it's like a small, like, cardboard-ass box, so when it goes through... That the glass rips the box open and wasps <laughs> just spread out. And like you thought like, oh, it's it's a, like a decently sized box. Like you could hold it in your hand like this. You did not think it was possible to contain this many wasps in this small oh, space. It's like it's like, looking, it's like looking at a wasp nest and then seeing how many come out. It's like Is it like those swarms of birds? No. No, it's like a swarm of wasps. <laughs> and they're not that a swarm of wasps. Natural habitat. <laughs> I mean, like. Finally, the... these injured people they're in their can finally habitat. get some uh, long. <laughs> these injured, these injured persons in this hospital who are in need of treatment can finally get some uh, emotional support. Think about it. You're giving the hospital free needles. Exactly, man. It's. Whether they want them or not. Hey Dalton, can I use speak with animals to see how these wasps are feeling? Um, yes, you can. Can I voice the wasps? <laughs> There's some okay. imagine one person like, oh my god, Gerald, how dare you release the wasps again? Gerald. Gerald. <laughs> Gerald. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Sorry, I'm, I'm doing a thing on, on, on the sidelines. I'm gonna get the vacuum. <laughs> the I'm vacuum. I just have wasp fever. So. I totally forgot that you had to speak with animals. So you cast right. speak with animals. And you... The first problem is that it's a bunch of wasps and they don't all speak at the same time. So it's kind of difficult to make out what they're saying. But you do catch in, in, in the, the fever... Various things such as um, sting, 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 defend, murder, kill, freedom, delicious raspberry jam. Wait. That one's weird. Hold on. <laughs> do wasps communicate the same way that bees do through dance? Probably. They communicate through violence normally. I was going to say, they use the universal language. But it doesn't matter. The, the speak of animal spell ignores that anyway. Yeah. Can we? Can can one of them just have a desire, a strong desire, to become a doctor at this hospital? <laughs> one of them goes white yes. coat, white coat. <laughs> want white coat? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Give me that stethoscope. Okay. I'm gonna. I like, diagnose you I'm with going... sting. It is terminal. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's done. Anyway, what's the next stop? I don't remember. Ah, whatever. I rolled like a negative two on my history. Yeah, uh, let's just go to the library. What? No. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> um, it was oh. hospital in and um... doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. They don't remember. I don't uh, remember. Stop, stop medicating. Remember. Did he hear any screaming <laughs> through the windows? Yes. Hey, just curious. <laughs> Oh. Yes. <laughs> Lovely. Just a wee bit or like a lot? Um, the sounds of a bunch of people with really bad allergies and cancer and a number of other tuberculosis involved and um, there's a lot of really uh, sick signal. people dying. Oh. You hear somebody else, I'm allergic to wasps! <laughs> He went quiet soon after. And that was the last word that he ever said. I just like, does somebody anyway. eat them? Just like grab them out of the air? No. Well, now that this I know that wasps, one. this isn't China. Well, now that the wasps are, uh, now that I know they like oh, uh, raspberry jam. Out. I'm not gonna cut that out. Just, just insert that one video of the Chinese guy walking through a swamp eating blue crabs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dalton. So the library. Yes. 
How's this library looking? How where where, where do I where do I place the wall? I have a book to here. You actually, I want to keep the book. Yeah, you bombed that oh. library. Now the first problem is that the, unlike the other places oh. you've been to, this library is closed. It has business hours, so it is there are double doors. It is dark. There's no one inside. Mm. You think you, you can't see anyone inside. Are are there? Is there no way? I how big is this box? It's like a foot by like four inches. A foot? It's like a foot long yeah. by like four inches wide. Okay. Is it possible to slide it? Are in? there? Yeah. Can I like yeah. slide it through the AC or something? <laughs> no, I was that thinking they have in the back? a little mail slot. <laughs> Oh yeah, that is a great idea. Mail they slide. do have. Oh wait, they should have like a book return wait, yeah, slot. They, do, right? they have a they have a small box next to the door that says book return. Oh no! I'm going to. That's a, book. That's a wonderful hey, book. Book. Are there are there any uh are there any like just stray pieces of paper that I can like write a little message down on to like put on the box here? Roll, roll an investigation check. To see if you can find any. Twelve. Good enough. You find like a little scrap of paper that's like was probably ri- okay. ripped out of a book. Can I write from Santa on this little piece of paper? Better What's question. Funny? Can you write? <laughs> Good <laughs> question. <laughs> Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Good question. <laughs> is she? Yes, she um, is. Okay. <laughs> That was not the question funny. here. The, the intelligence check isn't the thing here. Is is your intelligence high enough to understand like <laughs> how to write? <laughs> okay, like, okay. I feel Dom. like if there is only one thing that Ifrael knows how to write, it is from Santa. From Santa. <laughs> it, yeah, it's fair. Actually, wait. Do I like? If I roll below a twenty, I probably would have messed that up and wrote down like from Satan or something. <laughs> <laughs> That would have but, been uh, better. <laughs> it's a command. But anyway, I write I write from Santa down in this little like with a little heart down in this box, and I slide it into the and I slide it through the book return. Mm. And uh that one's for later. And now I'm gonna head back to the guy <laughs> who gave me these wasp boxes and tell him that the job is four. done. No, there was only three. No, a thing. character with five or less intelligence lacks the capacity to become literate at all. <laughs> <laughs> that is the greatest sentence I've ever heard. <laughs> become literate. At I guess I did all. write from Satan, man. Yeah. Form yeah. Satan. No, for- it is form yeah, Satan. Form Satan. He, he wrote like F R U M M. S N A N T A, Snanta. 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 Okay. <laughs> close um, enough. Christ. Um, close enough. The I man. Understand. He's short. He's put on a hat since you've last seen. So now he's got this like really tall like steam pipe hat. You know, like which is just top hat but really long. And he's he's smoking a pipe, and he's rubbing his hands just. Did you did you deliver the packages? Can I can I like just point to one of the buildings and he hears people screaming from it? <laughs> he, he sticks his ear sh- out and he goes, "What a beautiful symphony! I I just love wasps, you know, and and we need to share them with the world. Don't you agree? Absolutely. You know, I've been thinking about my reward for this. I don't want money." I want to be able to share the wasps with the whole world. He looks at you and, and a single tear falls down his eye. <laughs> and he says, I've never met someone. I've never met someone like you. <laughs> I've never met New shit. <laughs> Like you. you were a friend of the wasp dealer. You are a wasp dealer. This is a weird dream, Daddy Mod. 
<laughs> and he, he looks at you and says, if we if you need them, whenever you need them, wear it. I'll get them to you. Whenever. Monster whenever, high four going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> monster hard do you that mean sounds monster fantastic yeah monster from so you know get the point i'll see you around <laughs> wasp dealer the wasp national anthem plays as you leave it's just people screaming with like a bunch of buzzing <laughs> <laughs> it's the ussr anthem but just it's made of so, uh, about, about, uh, what's her name? Taylor's character? I forget her name. Uh, Isla. That's you are name. going to have to exit the inn in order to go places. Yeah. Yes. Isla, as you walk yeah. out of the door, um, at the end of the hallway to your right is, like, the suite, which is, like, the fancy room, and a man runs yeah. out, and he has a red bathrobe on, <laughs> and wasps are just, like, stinging him and following him. <laughs> And he's, Go he's, back he's, to he's, he's an elven <laughs> man with long red hair. Uh. Well, um, um, I'm gonna go. <laughs> I'm just gonna run out the door. Um, you know. <laughs> Don, that, I, I, Don you know, are wasps? Wasps have face. to be like all over the main room, right? Yeah, at this point, because his like you dropped it into like the the like the suite way, which is where the chimney goes. But now that the doors open; they are just flooding the building. <laughs> I oh think that deserves a roll. <laughs> I don't Please know roll about you. A dexterity saving throw. Everyone, <laughs> except oh, for except for posse. Okay. I'm gonna just I'm just gonna walk back into the inn and go to sleep. Do the wasps good. bother me at all? No. <laughs> well you still have Perfect. speak with animals, so you can still hear them. Hmm. What do they say? <laughs> Various things as usual, you know. Kill, kill, stab. That's a really nice bathrobe, mate. Run your pockets. Um Is that a fish? I don't even Taylor know what a fish is, is but not I'm okay. Kill it. <laughs> yeah, Taylor. Yes. and Taylor are doing bad. <laughs> oh, I haven't checked the rules. Wait. Oh my god. No, don't get I got five. I got six. Oh my god. Oh no. Do you want me to roll again? No. Oh, no. No. Roll again no, you're not. No, no. Grace rules. No, no Grace rules. That's too bad. I have a seven. It's a 17. No, you take don't. Take the 17. Not doing take that. Take the 17. No, you think so. So, let me take roll damage seven. real quick. Relax. Taylor, I don't know. Relax. 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 Let's see, how many wasps are there? 700. Take the 17. Like, 2,000 per box? They, they were pretty big boxes, to be fair. Like, I'll one foot four. is... For how bad you guys rolled, I'll say four. Four wasps. <sighs> Uh, I'm chilling. I got like a, I got a twenty-four. You yeah. each take seven points of damage. <laughs> Be free. Be free. I blame you, the you fault don't... lies with you, Isla Porter. You were the one who decided to brave the wasps. <laughs> <laughs> Brave the Sometimes you gotta grab life by the stinger. <laughs> anyway, Sometimes you gotta I brave say, life I by the wasps. I escape the wasps, but I run. I like am booking it through this room, and I manage to at least, like escape them by one wasp. <laughs> by a single wasp. By a single wasp. So, you are now outside, Isla. The the uh. It's still late summer, so the the kind of warm night. The a, a light wind blows, aggravating your numerous wasp stinks. Oh, why? why make sure to <laughs> make sure to damage yourself in the character sheet. I don't know how to do that. So, 
You just you go to your HP and uh, decrease it by. <laughs> Is it almost time, Dalton? I will, yes. It's one more thing. Yes. Okay, I did it for you. Wait. I have an idea, and it's gonna go <laughs> terrible. Good. So, <laughs> Isla, you are now outside. What do you wish to do? Um, hold on one second. I'm, someone's messaging me. Anyway, um, <clears throat> I want to um go find something to entertain myself. Because now that I'm free and no one's watching me, I want to go cause some mayhem. <laughs> Just like game. Okay. Well, <laughs> is there anything particular you're looking for? Hmm. Specifically that man. In the last episode. You wish to find the library man. Not him. Oh, you the wish to find man. Mike. Yes, Mike. Okay. I have still a bone to pick with that man. Well, you've only ever seen him at his fruit stand, so I guess that would be the place you would start looking for him. Are you going to kill yes. Mike? Mike was great. I don't know about that. I won't, I, you, you, haven't, you don't know what I'm going to do. You don't know what I'm going to do. You're going to kill him. You're going to explode no, him. Not. No, I'm not. I know you're going to explode him if because I you did. almost did if I didn't stop you last session. <laughs> if I do, um, I will probably be very much in trouble with Caldeum, but that is fine. Okay, I'll, take, you know, I'll take. I'll take the fall. I'll take Hang on, the fall. I, I'll, I'll reset. Oh yeah, it you. is. Yeah, please. If you have the link to it, I'd like that. Yeah, here you go. Just so I can actually through the wasps. It. What time is it? <laughs> through <laughs> the wasps. <laughs> <laughs> it has been like three minutes, dude. Three more minutes until I have to come find you. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. no, 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 And give her a head start. So, you... That was the head start. <laughs> you retrace no. your steps from the previous day and come across an empty fruit stand that has, like, the there's, like, like tr uh, drapes over the fruit. Here, I'm going to stop you there one second. I want to say that I managed to get there... But I, like, I go behind, if, like, he's there, I go behind him, and I'm about to throw it, and then Khaldun just appears right behind me. That'd be very funny, but he's not there. No. Oh, that's sad. But that would nope. be, that would be. No but matter anyway. what happens to you, good or bad, I will come find you after three hours. That you is missed? fair. Yeah. You gave me too long. I'm you gave me too long you enough time to get into trouble. Yeah, if you exactly. Send me like the actual link. That would be appreciated. Anyways, continue, Dalton. Sorry. Okay. Oh, the actual link. Yeah. I don't know if they have that. Hang on, let me I find mean, it. If you if you can find it. Um. Okay. So yeah, there's a fruit stand. Um. It's you. You know, it's the one that Mike was running, but it is not currently being tended to. Um. Mm -hmm. Um, you can roll investigation to see if you can like find some form of some clue to where he might be now. Okay, one moment. Um, someone's trying to message me. I like to think while this is happening, a policy's just still fighting the gator. Yes. I haven't fought anyway. Anything. Um, anyway, what did you say to what? Investigation. Okay. I got an eight. Got an eight. Yes. Did you even? Okay. Don't question my methods. Uh, Don't question my methods, Dalton. You rolled a two. <laughs> Shut up. Okay. You don't find any indication of where he might have gone. Although. Can I keep it, looking? It's I'm not, very that, determined. That, that role is not high enough to find, like, direct indication. But it is high enough to know that, like, he... It's on, like, a busy street, but it's just a stand outside of, like, a row of apartment complexes. Hmm. So if you had to just wager... Interesting. Guess, he lives somewhere near here. Interesting. 
more fun for it to explode every single house until I find him. You're just a terrorist. I mean... <laughs> so, quick pause there. We're going to shift. A posse! Yay! <laughs> you are in the sewer. There are yep. sewer gators. At least one. At least one. I was going to ask you how many there are, but I guess you're hiding that from me. <laughs> It's kind of hard. I, I, I'm not hiding you. The completely opaque water is hiding that. The water that Would does you... not allow you to see through it is hiding that. Well, I see one. I'm going to preemptively use a lucky dice here. Um, for what I'm about to do. I'm going to assume this requires animal handling. Depends. But... What are you trying to do? I want to play fetch with the sewer gator with a crowbar. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Wordless. <laughs> Just so you know, he mouthed that three times before he actually said it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna roll that. Don't, I don't think I'm able to send you like the actual sheet yeah, I, mean, I made. Cool. As I, I, I can. I, I can, can just send you it. the creator. Yeah. <clears throat> Is it animal handling? It would be animal handling, yes. Alrighty. That's one. That's a six. And number two. That's also not great. That's a seven. You. It's not gonna go great for me. You but throw it's gonna be funny. your crowbar. And you know when, like, an alligator gets hit with, like, something falls on it and it just starts freaking out? <laughs> and snapping. That's what this thing does. And it does that briefly. Oh. And it locks eyes with you. Oh no, he's locked in. <laughs> <laughs> You're getting mogged by this croc. So. Uh, yeah. Apostle, well, do me a favor. Uh-huh. Roll initiative. Good. Yes. <laughs> this is going to go great for me. <laughs> I will send you the map. Lovely. I had to make this very quickly because... I felt mm. in my bones that you were going to do something like this, for example. I knew, I knew it was going to interior end. crocodile I, alligator. I got a nineteen, Dalton. I am a Chevrolet movie theater. <laughs> is it gonna have... Well, <laughs> what'd you get, Richley? I got a nineteen. I already said nice, very nice. I Better than my wow. two. Um. The gator got a 296. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, the gator got just a six. Mm. Okay. The gator now dies. Which means that we begin gator with a posse. Oh, let me mm -hmm. put the tokens down. This will all be kind of the episode. Oh, perfect. I drive a Chevrolet movie theater. Oh my gosh. The theater must have died. <laughs> By the way, did I mention this that thing is, is fucking huge? That is one big giant gator. Did I mention the thing? This thing is fucking huge. I'm sorry if I forgot to mention that part. This thing is fucking huge. This is not is a gonna... small gator. Will it be impossible for me to kill this thing on my own? Let's find out. Hey, Dalton, uh, if it's looking rough, can you just have like a swarm her. of wasps drop me into the <laughs> sewer? <laughs> it's, it's like instant transmission, but with wasps. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> I'm gonna the be wasps fine. knew that you needed help. The wasps knew they could not change society, so instead of reflecting upon themselves, they blamed the bees. It looks like this is the end of me. I'm glad I made a backup character already. Okay, what do you wish to do? First, I go into a rage. Of course. Roll that dice. Roll. Um... Whatever it is. Hold on. Um, uh, 1d8 roll. I got a 1. 
That is shadow tendrils. Each creature of your choice that you can see within 30 feet of you must succeed a constitution saving throw or take 1d12 neurotic damage. You can also Oof. gain 1d12 temporary hit points. Cool. <laughs> neurotic damage. <laughs> okay, roll, roll a d12. <laughs> Who did that? <laughs> and roll this... a d12 for what? Possibly game. I haven't even attacked it. Well, that's just like a general. Also, you need to determine your um, temporary hit points. Interior, okay. Um, one d twelve. Do do do. I got twelve. I'm gonna put that in my hit points. Put it in your temporary um, hit points. Temp hit points. Give me twelve more, please. <sighs> <laughs> Good. How lucky. Now, the. Tendrils automatically lash out, I believe, because it's within 30 feet of you. Okay. Do you choose to attack this crocodile? I guess so. I want it to be, um, I don't know if neurotic damage could be non-lethal. Can it? Neurotic. I, w- <laughs> I don't know. It's just how I'm going to say it. Neurotic. <laughs> necrotic damage as magic cannot be non-lethal. But also, Can- I'm just telling you this now, it does not matter how much it, it will not die from this. Fair enough. So, okie dokie. Going to You're gonna kill this long. crocodile yeah. through anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> anxiety uh, kills all. What is your spell save DC? I got another twelve. Um, uh, but my spell DC is eleven. Okay, so it has to beat an eleven. Yeah, or else it takes twelve. Let's see. It does not. Yay. Black ten- tendrils rip from below you and just begin slapping and whipping at this crocodile. <laughs> Bad boy. <laughs> With the pumpkin. <laughs> okay. Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Come on, Russian. You can do it. Come on. What? I don't know what I'm doing. You, What's happening? You you've used your bonus action, you still have an action. Okay. Um how far am I away? I mean how far are you, are you ever met? You're about um well, I have way too many tabs open. It's about 15 feet away from you. Cool, 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 cool. I don't have another bonus action. 50 feet. Um, I don't want to get too close to this thing. I want to be in within 30 feet of it for what I'm going to do. Okay. okay. <laughs> How far away? Help. <laughs> You have a ruler tool. D and Beyond has a new map tool that allows you to to use a ruler to determine the distance between you and an enemy. You're like ten to fifty. You're like ten to five feet away from it. Yeah. You are right next to it. You're ten feet away. Each square cool. is five feet. Cool. Uh, away. <laughs> I want to be within thirty feet. How how far? How far? Um, can I go? Let's see. Um, you have a, you have a movement of thirty feet. Yeah, but I need to be within 30 feet of it for what I want to do, so I can't get too far away. Um, Hold on. You're 19 feet away from it right now. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure. Right there. Hold on. Um, I'm going to go back. Around here. Yeah, right yeah. there is 30 feet for that cursor. Yeah. Okay, sorry, I was having technical difficulties. Anyways, um, I'm gonna roll to hit with a javelin. <laughs> okay, roll to hit. Um, does a eighteen hit? It does indeed. Roll that damage. Rolling damage. Um, and then plus what when I rage? What is it? Is usually plus, plus two. two. So I got. So that was a total of what? Eight, eight damn bullets. 
8 damage. The You throw this javelin and it sticks kind of into the face of this giant uh, crocodile. <laughs> mm, that's good. Anyways, and... let me look here. Let me see what I got. Dang it. I shouldn't have got rid of that second javelin. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Um, I think that's all I can do for now. Okay. Um, the crocodile is going to move towards you. Stomping through the shit water. <laughs> it's a bit of a tight fit. Mm -hmm. But it gets to you. And is going to attempt yeah. to bite you. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm so oh. sorry. That mm. 20. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad I prepared that second character, Dalton. I'm so sorry. You're killing me. Why don't me you try to roll with him, Dalton? No, I can't. The dice have made up their mind. I'm the slave to the winds. Because it's a tight well, fit, it disadvantage. Um. I mean, to be fair, she does have like 56 health. And she's raging. Yeah. Yeah, you have resistance to this. So it'll be... It, actually, I won't, I won't even need to roll the second half, so... Because it don't matter, um, I do twice, but since you have resistance to... Man, I don't need to, actually. So... 17 damage? Ooh, that's fun. That's all my temporary hit points. Um, that's twelve, and then five, one, three, four, five. Yes, do math, arithmetic. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Okay, that's fun. And now it is going to attempt to maneuver itself, like turn around. And it's going mm -hmm. to try to whack you with its tail. It's not going to be able to do that with that with this space. I'm rolling with disadvantage here because of how like confined you are. Does 15 hit? Yes, it does. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I tried. What's going on in Braylon's mic? I know. I think it's her dog. Maybe. 20. The dog. You take 20 yeah. damage. Oh! Well, that's great. If I took on this, I guess. Why are you like, doing that manually? What the fuck? What do you mean? <laughs> like, I saw it, like, manually tick down. I was at 39. 19 is less, is 20 less than 39, probably. Um... <laughs> You could have just typed in 20 and then hit minus. I do the way I like, okay? Give me this. I'm about to die. <laughs> okay. It is now your turn, yeah, by the way. Cool. Shadow tentacles, help. Shadow tentacles, ho! It has to roll a constitution okay. save. So, it failed! Yeah, that's great. Um... Does it give me temporary hit points every turn or just the first turn? Just the first turn. Uh, okay, so let's go. Another 12. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it begins whipping at this, this giant crocodile and it, is, it, it shouts in pain. No, I'm sad. I don't want it to die. I want it. I want a friend. <laughs> Even though it's trying to kill you? Yes. That's usually the way I make friendships. Yeah, have you not been paying attention to this whole game? Right? <laughs> no, I've, 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 I've... Okay, so... I've just been kind of trapped. So what will you be doing now? Okie dokie. Um, let's see here. I guess I'm close enough for Battle Axe. Uh... Let's see if this works. 
Ooh, that's not great. 11, does that hit? Is that, like, the total? 11? Yeah. Do you have any lucky dice left? Yeah, I got one left. I'm not saying that for any particular reason. I'm just saying, you know. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna... Hmm, sure. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna use it. <laughs> okay, that's totally your choice. Yeah. Oh, that's worse. <laughs> that's a not. It's not enough. I'm sorry. Yeah, I figured. Um. You, you, you uh, bring your your axe down on this uh, this scaly creature, but its scales are very tough, and you cannot penetrate its skin. I can't believe this is the way I'm gonna die. <laughs> Wow, Richly. So if you hadn't went into the sewer. Getting thrown a crowbar at a giant crowbar. You, in... uh, you are, in fact, not a Florida she man. Is fair. Yeah, I, I understand this is completely my fault, but I, I'm just very happy right now for no particular reason. <laughs> just, you know, try to run away from it. Just simply no. stop attacking. Yeah, nothing keeps you here. Away. Why would I nothing do... keep just leave so you can survive? <laughs> no, <laughs> Why would just do you that? want your character to die? I mean, better this way than to run away like a pleb. <laughs> what is this death okay. before dishonor shit? <laughs> My father was absent, but he raised, he did not raise a quitter. <laughs> 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 right, because it's not like you have a bonus action that will literally allow you to get away from this thing without provoking opportunity attack at all. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Not at all. But the tentacles, um, I could do that right now. You could. Cool. Yeah. Um, I guess so. What did but... she roll for her wild surge? Yeah, One. I already did. No, I was asking, what did you roll? One. The tentacles. Oh, okay. I guess I, I um but I guess I can use space step, yeah. Um <laughs> Um let's see. How, for my magic thing, what how how close? Uh 30 within feet. ten. Um so I go this way. Um <laughs> Okay, this is fun. Um <laughs> This is fine. I'm just that meme of that dog in the burning house. So okay, do you do you move somewhere or? Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. I'm I'm a ruler right now. Um, yeah, about <laughs> that far. Okay. What and... is your effect? What my effect right now is charm. Like, um, let me read. Immediately after you use face step, up to two creatures of your choice that you can see within ten feet of you must succeed a wisdom saving throw or be charmed by you for one minute. Or until your companions deal any damage to the creature. Okay. Do you wish to attempt to charm this crocodile? Yes, please. <laughs> okay, he does not have... Surprisingly, he doesn't have good wisdom. So. Yeah. You might just make... Fucking... <laughs> <laughs> actually, hold on, his wisdom's not actually that bad. Well, really? Yeah, it's, it's, it's a 10. It's as wise as a human. Oh. What's your DC? 11. It rolled a 10. Yes. And it has a nothing modifier. It is charmed by you and therefore cannot attack you. <laughs> wow. Against all comprehension, okay. you face step away and charm the creature. I'm back. She did all of that just to charm it and then walk away. I'm not walking away from this. What do you mean? <laughs> Don't assume anything I do. <laughs> so now you have. Don't advantage. assume anything I do then. Uh, one the minute. Cre like, the creature is charmed by you. One? In yeah. one minute. It's ten. Like, okay. It's, it's about ten. It can't do me any damage, right? A uh, charmed creature cannot attack the charmer. Um, cool. And you have advantage on any ability check to interact socially. So persuasion, and in this case, yeah. also animal handling. <laughs> fun, fun. Let's cut a deal. 
I'm gonna give him a snack. What snack are you trying to give this giant Tatooie's corpse? Tatooie. Tatooie's corpse. <laughs> New Tatooie? Tatooie's corpse. Roll uh, animal why? handling with advantage. Thank you. But why? <laughs> um, I'm glad that's with advantage. Please. Uh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Do I go get my real dice for this? I don't care. Up to you. Do you think you'll do better with them? Hold on, I'll be right back. Have you already rolled with your? Okay, well, whatever. So now that she's done. What the fuck? Holy shit! That was the closest thing. I swear she's actually trying to kill herself. Like I did everything I could do to say, hey, maybe don't fight this giant fucking crocodile that lives in these sewers. Listen, but no, so had do I, to. So do I drop the second <laughs> crocodile? I get what I want. A second I... crocodile has hit the mushroom. <laughs> Listen, Dalton, I either die or I get what I want, and that's how I want to live my life. Okay, then. Die, then. Roll your animal handling. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> she, she has to show herself as well. Jesus, are you the, okay? The... Hold on. Let it focus. Please focus. Oh shit, you're showing this on It ain't gonna focus. It's not gonna It's focus. not focusing. Just tell Oh, is that all a... is that all a... it's literally 20? also your dice is impossible to see what the numbers are on it. It's a mushroom. What does that say? Got a mushroom in it. It's so dark. I, I cannot see that. That's it. Oh, 20. Oh, it's 20. Not 20. Okay. Not 20. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> that was not <laughs> visible at all. Uh, sorry, but I just got so excited. You hand out the corpse <laughs> of this small rat. And the crocodile opens its mouth. Expectingly. <laughs> waiting. I toss him in. Anybody's chewing and eating. I'm down a tattooy corpse. Gotta get a fresh one. Yeah. <laughs> so. Don't worry, you'll have plenty of um, new exploded things soon. Speaking of which, transition <laughs> back to the C plot. Oh I love four plot. What are you doing currently? How much how much time do I have right now left? Currently? How much time does she have left? How well before he comes how long did you give her? literally yells at me. I gave her three He gave hours. me like four three oh. hours. Oh, you still got like two and a half hours. Yeah. You got time. Time to cause mayhem. <laughs> Alright. So I wanna say that she continues down. Where she was left off, where we left her off, she's continuing down to look through these houses. Okay. Like I want, like she's at least civilized, and she'll knock on these doors. She's not gonna just go up and explode each one as she goes by, you know. Um, yeah, she really wants to. Um, she's not gonna do that. She's more civilized than you'd think. For the record, real quick, I just like to mention. Um, how many bombs would you say your character has on them? Hmm. Because I'm adding actual bombs, because the bombs you have aren't actual bombs. So I'm adding bombs that have yeah, actual um, damage and stuff. Mm, I want to say she at least maybe has a good, like, ten on her. Gotcha. Because she hasn't got to use them yet. Actually, she's used, uh, she's used uh, one. I was going to say one. Well, she's used one. She's used one, so... So nine. To nine, and that one was for the tree, the poor tree, <laughs> the poor tree, poor poor tree, <laughs> poor tree. I'm stupid. A waste of an explosive, man. <laughs> a waste of a bomb. Really, a waste. 
A sad, sad waste. Sad waste. She could have used those uh, uh, that tenth one to explode Mike even further down into the ground. But you know. Okay. Your inventory's been updated. Perfect. Mm. I never realized just how much these bombs would cost. <laughs> Good. Like, if you got into the terrorism business, like the business, you could fucking make a mint. Anyway. So, are you just going Very door nice. like like a Jehovah's Witness? <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> I'm going door to door asking if Mike lives in this hell in in a particular house. And heard about our Lord and Savior terrorism? Okay. So the first door you open, it has this uh, little old lady behind it. And he goes, "Hello, Hello dearie. What do you want?" Hello. I'm looking for a man named Mike. Oh, Do you know who that is by chance? Of course I know young Mikey. He's a pillar of the community. He's the greatest oh, man love. you'll ever meet. <laughs> that's lovely. Do you know by chance where he lives? Yes, dearie. Down the hall. Three doors. What are you doing All right. so late at night? Would you like some watch candy? <laughs> Just uh, walking around, you know, looking for Mike in particular. I feel no like reason. she would offer a mint. She reaches into, uh, she, she like reaches to a side bowl she has next to the door. And says, here, yeah, some candies. Like it's always Halloween. <laughs> yes. You know how old people Thank just kind of keep a bowl of candy for visitors? Yeah. Literally, she is a fish. She doesn't know what candy is. So when she Clearly. eats it, she literally just falls in love with it. Clearly. It's uh, addictive. Richly, you have not been interacting with the proper old people. <laughs> yeah, as we know, sugar doesn't exist underwater. My grandma's been in the hospitals. Yeah. Bring down the whole mood one. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, candy doesn't exist under the water, but she adores it now that she's tried it. <laughs> okay. Anyway, I say she she then goes and continues down. She she says goodbye and continues down. Okay. Continues her journey. So do you, you, I assume you go. I'm to, on uh... my way. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Actually, you know, I don't need to do that. I was going to do something really stupid and more complicated than I really needed to, but I I, I will do this the quick and easy way. Why don't you just do it the Dalton way, aka the way that you said first? Yeah, but like, <laughs> then I have to sit here and, and like... Nice and easy. Technique. Nice and easy way. Do it the easy way. Let's go golfing! Uh, Come on, Dalton. Yeah. I'm, just, I'm so happy. Yeah, don't you love when you when you almost die? <laughs> and it works out my way, yeah. Come on, Dean DeBeyond, don't be slow on me. God, I have to verify that I'm a human one more time. <laughs> Are you not a human, Dalton? Look, I know I have like eight tabs open, Dean DeBeyond, but I promise you, I'm not a bot. <laughs> Are you sure, Dalton? <laughs> I think so. You think uh, that's a likely story, Dalton? I'm just a horrible Disney princess. Okay. I am also basically at this point, but I love explosives and destruction. Okay. Anyway, so you you walk up to his door. What do you do? Do you do you knock? Do you do you just? Mm -hmm. I don't want to actually have any confrontation with this man. I'm just going to simply, if he has like a mail slot on his door by chance, does he? Sure. All right. I'm going to just take a bomb out of my hand and I'm going to stick it in this mail slot, but I'm going to already light it. I'm just going to stick it in there. Okay. You. <laughs> and then run. 
Light <laughs> this bomb. How long would you say it takes this bomb to, to um, mm. detonate, would you say? It takes me about a good five minutes. So it gives me about a good five minutes to get out of there. You're gonna kill that old lady, too? So, she was so nice. I have a question. No! Do you just no. run as far away, or do you stay around to, close enough to watch? I want to stay close enough to watch. <laughs> okay. Time ticks by. One minute. Two minutes. Three minutes. Four minutes. Tick. Tick. And then... Boom, the entire building goes up in smoke. And it's at that point that... That as the fire <laughs> is spreading... A window on the on the second floor will burst and break. And a man holding two children under each arm. Shirtless falls and he lands. Superhero landing while holding the yes, kids. My... A dog over a do a small puppy slung over his shoulder. Oh my god. Mike his... is amazing. Never it's my shirt. Oh my <laughs> Mike, Mike, Mike. He, he's not wearing a shirt, but he does have his, his headband on. He's like Solid snake Wait, style is this bandana. Mike? And this is Mike bandana. stands there. Wait. Okay. <laughs> Him having two children in his hands implies that he kicked open the window. <laughs> he did. <laughs> and he has a dog on his shoulder. And a dog on his shoulder. And he sets the kids down. And um, roll a perception check to see if you can hear him. Oh, well, okay. Eighteen. Nice. Um, he like kneels down. He 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 like he puts his hand. I want to say that I'm far enough away for him to not see me. Yeah, you're like in an alley, like kind of like crouched down, looking. Yeah. And he, he yeah. puts his hand on one of the kids, and he says, he takes the like the puppy off his shoulder, and he hands it to to the young girl. And he says, "Look after Kibbles for a minute. I'm gonna go save Mama." And then he he runs back in yelling. Aww. The mom that gave him the bandana. And after three minutes, he kicks a different window out. And he's like bridal carrying this woman. And he, he oh. said, and I was like, I'm so happy I got my family to safety. All oh. in a day's work. That's the power of fruit. Oh. <laughs> That's what happens when you eat your fruit, kids. Don't forget. Oh. Nah. Anyway. Now, don't you <laughs> see that? Says, what were you gonna say, Dalton? Don't you worry, kids. I'm gonna find who did this. I'm I want to say make that sure I they can never hurt us again. Creep my little way. In. I want to say that I creep my little way in further into the darkness of the alleyway, and then I just run back to the inn. Roll a stealth. Taylor, check. not the little guy. You're a terrorist. <laughs> a murderer. No, I'm not. They didn't die. It was, it was a it's... teaser bomb. It was a teaser bomb. It's not an actual killer bomb. <laughs> it was, it's fine. It was just a little goof bomb, you know? What do you it mean it wouldn't goof tell bomb. them? Goof They're bomb. civilians. They have, like, four health. It's fine. They wouldn't have died. It they only would have takes died four one and a half point times damage. over. It only takes, like, two damage. It's fine. Also, you don't, also no, roll it's... a stealth check. Roll a stealth check, please. A stealth check? Right. Yes. Eighteen. Jesus Ooh. Christ. Oof. <laughs> 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 oh, don't go laughing just yet. I know. <laughs> Dude, you gotta beat his perception. Which he's proficient oh, yeah. in. <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you eat your carrots. <laughs> your skin turns orange. Your skin turns orange. Oh no. It's not Donald Trump. You got a what exactly? <laughs> 18. Okay, that's high enough. He didn't roll that high. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're too short. He, he's expecting someone at eye length. <laughs> He's not expecting me. He didn't expect the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> the Atlantic Inquisition. <laughs> the Atlantic Inquisition. Exactly. Anyway. 
Okay. Onward. I could have expected the conquistadors of El Dorado. <laughs> Onward back to the inn, so that way I can go self a paw. Okay. You slip. Uh, Keldon, it's been like 45 minutes. And Isla Surely he had to hear it. And you do hear a, a very l loud explosion from a little bit away. So, oh, actually, you would have heard that when it happened. So, would you have gone to search when that happened, or would you have waited? Nope. <laughs> nope, he just let it happen. Like I'm true nope. to my word. I'm <laughs> waiting sure three word. hours, whether you come <laughs> back or not. Okay. Okay. So, you return. I didn't even if spend you any of that money trouble, that you gave me. You're going to have to fend for yourself for however long. Has Velfi been doing anything? I actually? didn't spend. No. I think Velfi's no. just been on the bed. Huh? Vel Velfi's just no, been Velfi Vel <laughs> No, she's been doing stuff. But, like, but who knows when? what she's doing? You would! <laughs> anyway. I haven't yeah, even right. spent the uh, money been, like, yet wandering. that Khaldun gave me. I haven't Is even she spent the She's yet. been... So, no, Velfi's been looking for a... Um... God, what is the word? Um... Just like, Ooh. like a theater. Oh. oh, something for entertainment. A theater. A theater. I mean, you got. Anyways, I want to say that I don't go straight to the inn. Actually, I changed my mind. Isla does not go straight to the inn, or the inn. She goes and tries to buy stuff because she realizes that she forgot that she needs to spend the money that Caldoom gave her. <laughs> okay. Uh, what time Wait, of, what are you looking for, and what, like, what kind of shop would you be looking for? Um, specifically more bombs. <laughs> well, you know, as a practitioner of the black powder arts, yes. while there aren't really places okay. that sell bombs, there are black powder shops. Oh. So while you would have to make like the casing and yourself, you will... You you could probably find a, a shop that sells um, the powder. powder. Okay, that's fine. That works. Wow, Posse, you have quite the fight ahead of you. What do you mean? Hey, I don't. <laughs> Yo. Can you check your DMs? It's fine. I won't. I won't target anyone of our group. It's fine. It's definitely not probably. like I'll target the fungus. I guess I'll, that's <laughs> probably, yeah. I could kill you in Okay. <laughs> I have a sewer gator with a taste for flesh. Oh, yeah, that's fair. That's true. That's true. Are the wasps still in the building? Yeah. yeah. Probably. <laughs> why would they that is be? why she doesn't go back to the building. Mm. <laughs> okay, so you do eventually find, like, um... Uh, Stan's Black Powder Emporium. All right. Or no, just Stan's Powder Emporium. He smells all. Yeah, kinds you're of right. Powder. You are better. While you... she's doing this, but what? Uh, can I can I attempt to drive out the wasps? If you're saying a bad name, I'd like to mention that I give normal names to normal humans. You're the weirdos who have your freaky names. Shush. Mine is not freaky. I'm sorry, Jay. Thank you. Okay, first of all, don't judge my actual player character that I've made. That's a normal name for a normal human. No. Don't yeah, judge mine. Mine's not weird. Anyway. What's his name? It's just Jay. And it's not even his real name. Jay. Uh, anyways. Anyway. Jay is a normal name. Yeah. I have a name. I know, I know a couple guys named Jay, actually. Yeah, I do too. Anyway, so I also a boy named G. You enter this um this uh They're both method shop. Okay then. <laughs> <laughs> and there's like um uh, there's like uh glass bottles on the on the wall that have like different powders. Mm -hmm. Like there's like a wall that has seasonings, mm -hmm. there's a wall that has like, Evan. powdered uh <laughs> bone. What? <laughs> powdered heaven. And there's a man with I'm gonna lose cooking? Milk. What is the uh not cooking? <laughs> well <laughs> Landon, do you know you know like like the old medicine things? Like the uh it's just like a, a stone tablets. bowl that 
you uh, mortar and pestle. Mortar and pestle. A mortar and pestle. I hate that. Yeah. I only needed one person to answer. But yeah, mortar and pestle. There's like a man with like an eye patch. He has like silver hair, a silver beard. Very old. He has an eye patch. He's like faces scarred up. And he's like grinding at powers right. behind the uh, the desk. Four rockets down. <laughs> I want to say that uh, she also has her goggles over her face currently at this moment because she literally wants to go pretty much incognito. That's her way of quote unquote uh, yeah. going incognito. So stealthy, the the flaming red haired <laughs> shrimp person. Don't worry, like exactly. she's like you're both pyromaniacs. <laughs> I couldn't see her hair and I couldn't see her eyes, and therefore I have no way of identifying her. Exactly. <laughs> so the man looks up from his uh his mixing and goes <clears throat> what do you want i am looking for gunpowder by chance you do you today? have any <laughs> he gets this far away looking if you have any gunpowder by chance gunpowder i remember the day i first encountered gunpowder oh. No, During no, he's back. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> um, Anyways, can we continue on with my gunpowder session? Yes. <laughs> Wait, what? So the man starts. Uh, he goes into like this, this long monologue about how his time in the war Harper. and how he just discovered gunpowder and how he loves it so much. Harper, are you doing all right? And I want to say that Isla's just sitting there. She's just like shaking her head. She's like, "Yeah, I have no idea what you're talking about, but uh, I need some gunpowder." <laughs> Oh, sorry. I need to see some ID. I don't own ID. <laughs> sorry. She's a fish. She Legally don't own one. Can't sell black powder to uh miners. Darn it. Um, I'll be back. If I get one, can can I, if I get a person, would a library I... card count as as an ID? Why no. Not to just yeah, rematerialize. Would. Would would another person's card, uh, by chance a lot older than me, work for you? He looks at you and just goes, "If I get this, if I get this actual person in the building, like right here, right now." If you need someone to buy this, and they are of yeah. age, then yes, yeah, they can buy this, but you All cannot right. buy this. All right, that works. So. I'll be back. Okay, I'll be back. Anyway, back to the um the room. Landon. Oh no! It's not, <laughs> it's, been back about, in the room. it's not been about twenty minutes. Um, not no twenty. Uh, like forty minutes. Sorry, since uh, uh, Isla left. And Calvin, what would you? What were you doing? Uh, last time I was in. Uh, forty-five minutes. Yeah, sorry, forty-five minutes. Fifty minutes. I don't care, man. It's been like an hour. We'll say that. I've been keeping track. <laughs> I want to say anyway. that Isla is uh, like currently. Like sprinting with her tiny, as far as her tiny little legs can go. I was, I was gonna take out the book and summon Laganam. So, oh, real quick, I want to to check. Clayton, are you back for real? Yeah, for a little bit. Okay, cool. Um, you summon uh, Laganam, and while normally when you summon things, it just appears. This time, not only does it appear, but on the ground, a black inky pool begins to. <laughs> To form, and a cocoon oh rises, and you hear. <laughs> so, you return from the void. Um, the Matt, what you know? I don't know. What good? What good? You return from the from the two hour long caramel dancing goon sesh. <laughs> Oh, I love the caramel <laughs> dancing goon sash. You were in fact still pretty walking. He comes out doing the Hikari dance from JUK. <laughs> yeah, Gabe's doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Crouch down for more authenticity. What's going on, gang? What's going on, gang? What's going on, gang? Hey. Anyway. 
Uh, what I'm is happening tell... in this exact moment? So, as you rematerialize, so does a small, very short, about like two and a half feet tall uh, creature. It has very wide ears, very big eyes, a terrifying mouth, two massive horns. It's standing on two legs. It has a long tail. It's like gross looking. It's got like like leathery gross skin it's got like kind Dobby? of spines this sounds like a teeth wing Dobby does he have a sock does Dobby have a sock this sounds like a project of a product of Braylon Rell this sounds like a knife eared gremlin gold stealing teeth wing it's mine gold for the record stealing. it also okay. uh, and this is a it has like because I, I'm sorry, I have to do this. It's just the way that I have made this character in my mind. Um, it has a paper boy cap. Yeah, okay. Oh. And it looks at us. Hey, yo, boss man, what's up? What, you, what are we doing here, boss man? Lago no. Is that a cyberpunk Edge Runners reference? You see no. the wasp in this room, yes? Oh, yeah, there are a lot of wasps in this room. I love them. I'm hungry, though. Can I eat them? Turn into them? one yourself. Drive them into where they came from, and then you may feast. Okay, boss man. And he, his bones <laughs> crick and crack, and he and it erupts in a puff of smoke, and he is now and a small green wasp. They came from me, right? Come back this time. Okay, boss come man. Come back this time. What happened last so time? So you can, you can hear he says, All right, guys, come on, guys, let's go. We gotta get moving. Pick up the pace. Come on. And he, sp he circles these wasps and he, he pulls them out with him. And now you and at the at you and I just I don't know if you got the name of the man Ionor are in I the did. room together alone. Um, now to deal with you. First off, base shirt. <laughs> <laughs> God, I, I've never been happier that this is not a visual podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I have never been happier that there no one Bray, can see Bray is now Bray's, oh. Bray's back. Anyway. <laughs> Nothing happened. I haven't been here the whole time. <laughs> Who are you oh. and what are you? There was a demon... Uh, no, no answer. Just there was a demon. Wait, wait, wait what? what? I, I was, was asking I ask you a something? question. Yes. Oh, what'd you ask me? Who are you and what are you? Who is asking me this? Me. You, is your character asking me this? Yes. I am the will of Abedinox. Do you not understand? Yes, I demon? got that. I mean your name. Oh, I have many names. In the ward, I am simply INR. But to me, I am also INR. And to everyone else I associate with, I am also INR. Like I said, many names. Many, many names. <laughs> My parents, they call me INR. Good to know. I've also and been described as the Mad INR. I see. I Are can see that. <laughs> God, damn it! <laughs> For those who can't see, it witches everyone every single time. <laughs> Stop shaking your hips at us, Clayton. My new favorite thing to do. I love too this. seductive. He's doing, and he's, now why can you do the caramel dancing thing so fast? Why is he so skilled? Yeah, he does, he's, he's on I have animal lots flow. of experience. In the, he's on that yeah, animal, animal, animal flow. flow. His, his girth to speed animal. ratio is breaking my brain right now. He's on that animal <laughs> flow. I'm on that Dracula flow. Gabriel's on that beef flow. <laughs> Wasp. Yeah, whatever. Different things. Mm -hmm. oh, you, you just inside again. I was on that demo man flow. <laughs> Shush. Does Gabriel join me? Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, there's a good Dolph, can you make a more distressed face? 
Uh, never mind. I need my hip enhancer. <laughs> <laughs> As you were saying before you melted through the ground. Actually, what have you raised? What? What have you raised? What have you raised? Show me some of your magic. Huh? Oh, oh. Okay. What I can do? I can surely grant this. Can I preemptively cast False Life? Listen, I'm I mean, proud yes, of... you can. I'm... I can't wait for Clayton cool. to break it down. Is there any? Style. Is there a? Is there a bird flying nearby? Is there a bird flying overhead? Or are we inside of a building? You're inside a building. Is there? I don't know, like a bug flying in the air. Well, that actually, it's funny you should say that, because I imagine <laughs> when you came back, there was just set up a bunch of wasps around. So I imagine if you really wanted to, okay, you well, could. I like to find... not disturb them, so I would. Are, what what kind of building are we in? Uh, a wooden inn, and you're inside a bedroom. Oh, I would like to cast a firebolt on the wall. <laughs> okay. 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 You cast firebolt, and the wall erupts in flames. <laughs> <laughs> I have never had a session that had so many arsonists. Yeah. I was I expecting you to attack me, but this will do. Um, you see, I am, I must be told very expressly exactly what you want. I'm like a genie in ways. If you ask me to do something, <laughs> it must be very specific and to the point. If you do not ask these very specific ways to things to the very point that you want, I will typically fail and do something else that is slightly related to it. If you were to ask me to eat your fish friend, I would eat your fish friend. But if you no. were to ask me to <laughs> play with your fish friend, I would still eat your fish friend because you've never explained to me what playing is. <laughs> anyway, on the game. Why? Why? If you were to ask me to cast Firebolt, I would eat your fish friend. <laughs> yes. Because he's not Why expressing what cast me? the Firebolt is. You what did I are do to you? <laughs> but you are I undeniably skilled. Yes, I am a skilled magician. I can't wait to go to the digital circus with my skills. <laughs> no. I'm so pomny. I'm so pomny, Caldoon. I'm so pomny. Get him out of here. He's out of control. He needs to go back in the black hole. Back to the black no, hole you came from. I will from. not return. I will not return from beyond the veil. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'd like to, like, this whole thing is that we cut to this, like, Velfi, like, eating popcorn, watching a stage production. <laughs> it's like, the props are really good at this. No, she's hev she's heavily critiquing it because she this is all she's ever done with her life. <laughs> it's like, what were they thinking with that casting? <laughs> Dawson is yeah, clearly yeah. stated in the original material to be exactly six foot two inches and three quarters, but that actor is clearly six foot two inches and one quarter. Gabriel, what was this? Yeah. Gabriel, why are you hitting the? Well, I'm using a real argument I've heard Braylon use. That is a lovely argument. Good job, Mom. But well, don't... regardless, there is not much for either of us to do. Dalton. Yes. I want to name my gator. Come on. Smash cut. My, yeah, my stuff is done. So. Smash cut back to the sewer. Smash. Yay. The giant crocodile is looking at you. Cool. Ow. Big is its mouth. Big. Not Big enough to fit a fish-sized person? Definitely. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Why? I hereby dub this sewer gator Mike. <laughs> Why'd you call him Mike? Why Mike? 
it was gonna be Tatooie too, but after that display with Mike. <laughs> <laughs> What did he just do? Play? I can only get so much more wreck. You need to stop. I think hey, play, 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 do this one again. Uh, sinking black hole in the yeah, floor. <laughs> For those of you who can't see, which is everyone, he is currently busting it down California girl style. I got a border <laughs> style. A little bit of zero to zest. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Pretty anyway. Well. Anyway. Oh, man. Did you do, do you say, like, your name is Mike to the to the crocodile? Yes. Your name will be Mike from now on. It, like, mm-hmm. grumbles. Just Why mm. Why do you do this? You can't tell if it was affirmative or dismissive. That's fine. We'll tell. We'll see. If you get, if you want a different name, we'll figure it out. Let's go. Let's go back to the inn where all the wasps are. So you immediately realize that there's a problem with that. Yeah. You went. You went, there. The only way out is through a manhole. Mm. This thing is one. It cannot climb stairs, or it cannot climb a ladder. Mm-hmm. Secondly, yes. it's yes. fucking massive. Are you ableist? <laughs> no, I'm sizeless. Okay, Taylor, do you want a deal? Taylor? What? Do you want to strike a deal, Taylor? Sure. <laughs> I'll help you get your gunpowder if you help me explode this sewer so I can get my pet gator out. Deal. No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if there's anyone on, to talk I about to free find animals. You first. I have to find you first because I was going to Khaldun because he was the one that gave me the money. Oh, yeah. So... First of all, I'm going to go straight to Khaldun, and then I'll go find you, because he, maybe he won't help me, because he's being a foot. He's so, busy dealing with whatever's going on with Clayton. So does, yeah, and I really don't want to be near Clayton. So does a posse also begin trekking back to the, um... The end. I'll get, I'll get Mike as far as I can to the exit of the sewer, and then I'm... Um, I'll just try to find, um, Isla, uh, so I can get my gator out. <laughs> well, Isla's running as fast as she can on her little legs and how far they can go back to the end, so she's not going any- she's not stopping, because <laughs> she's on a mission. <laughs> well, I guess I'll go to the, um, the the guy with all the powder and cocaine, you know. Why are you, you don't, going? You, don't, you, you, you don't know where that shop is, and also you don't know that she went there. Unfortunate. Yep. I'm on my you way. have to know that I went there first to go there. I can look. I need explosives. What are, what are my surroundings currently? Am I still near Khaldun? Yes. Yeah. You're still, still in the on-fire room. Yes, it's still on fire. Anyways, I want to say that she like made, to it, track the scent made it the to fish. the end. I want to say she made it to the end, but she, you... like, sees that it's on yeah. fire. Uh, you return to the end, and it is on fire. <laughs> oh, is the fish back at the end? <clears throat> <clears throat> you know what? Because we kind of wow. read this earlier. Uh, Eonora, you can feel that the fish has gotten closer. Oh, no. Good. <laughs> oh, no. Caldoon, I smell a fish nearby. Something's getting fishy here. Uh, it's just like me when Shoddy hasn't taken a shower in three weeks. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I can smell a pussy from three miles away in a snowstorm. Anyways, um, I'm going to continue, even though it's on fire. I'm gonna go and find Khaldun, regardless, because I'm an idiot. I would like, I would like to hide in the shadows. I would like to conceal myself within the shadows. Is it the fish or the? I figured out another way to get the gator out. So one at a time. Stealth check. Play stealth check, please. Check. Okay. Yes, sir. Stealth check. Fuck. Where's that shit? Stealth. Plus two. Let's fucking go. <laughs> so, uh, Dalton, I was still asleep until this fire started. I guess. Oh yeah, because you went back and, and you just went back to bed, didn't you? Yeah. 
Just I'm going to wake up and get out of there. So you awaken to a fire being <laughs> you're distorted. Got an 11, Dalton. Okay. I'm just going to head out of the house. Hold on to that for a minute. Like this, you, and, you and I will like, pass each other, I'd say, on the way. Me? Yeah. yeah. Mm. So, Isla, you see if I will just, like, leave. Where are you going? I'm just not going to answer. I'm going to take off my helmet and wipe the sweat off because it was really hot being next to a fire. Actually, in well, full plate now armor. that I think about it, is this the first time that we've actually seen Ifrael's face? Y yes. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Please kindly describe well, the, the face of your character. Isla also has. First time anyone also, has Isla has always seen After eight, after eight episodes. <laughs> describe your character's face, face, Gabe. Yeah, okay, so Ephrael is, uh, she has a rather childish face. She is, what, hey, is, what is it? Yeah, uh, you notice she has, uh, two small horns coming from her head. She is green for the most oh, part. Her hair is dark green. Her skin is, uh, light green. It's kind of like a goblin, but not. <laughs> Imagine a goblin with horns. It's kind of it. Yeah. Basically. Imagine Chowder from Chowder, but green. Yeah, stubby nose, <laughs> big eyes. <laughs> so Chowder from Chowder. No. But green. What is your sure. That's me, the M16. And uh, let's see, shoulder length, straight, dark green hair. What's her eye color? Black. <laughs> Boyd's. Black soul. Um, anyway. And you notice she also has uh, green scales kind of going across her face like roots. Interesting. I'm sorry, I thought of the movie Roots. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm like, just saying, I was kind of like shocked because she's never like seen Raphael. Uh, Raphael. Face. I've never said their names. I've never said their name. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Ninja Wait, no, <laughs> legally distinct. I'm horrible frogs. at saying names. <laughs> That's my bad. Anyway. Um, Jiu -jitsu but I've never lizards. seen their face. We can't say Kung Fu Frogs because that was in the 2012 series. Yeah. Um, anyway. Pubrit but yeah, pubescent? Jiu-Jitsu Lizards. Anyway, let me uh, let me restate anyway, the character's appearance. Yeah. Slightly green skin, green root-like scales going across her face, shoulder-length dark green hair, completely black eyes, or I should say the sclera aren't black, it's just like the, yeah. what's it called? It's really dark. Pupil? Pupils. Pupil. Iris? Iris. Iris. Yeah. Cornea. That's the word. Small nose. You don't see any ears because they're like lizard ears. Oh, oh! Uh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> the implications of that took a minute to set in. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna say that when Isla sees her face, she's just gonna kind of be slightly like shocked because she's never seen her face before, <gasps> but also like <gasps> you're like green. Dog <laughs> jump. You're alive. First time she's shown her face in eight episodes. <laughs> and to the one character that I'd probably never think she would. Oh, I don't even notice you. Face, yeah. It's a face oh, but reveal, but it's that. just like it's like Dream's face reveal, but okay. literally not the face reveal. This is like reveal. the second episode in a row we've mentioned Dream. We need to pull back on. <laughs> yeah. This is like a pull. badass moment where, like, if we're not like. On she uh, like takes off her mask and there's like fire behind her. The mask is all <laughs> out of Stormy Daniels. Anyways, I was gonna continue going up the flaming stairs. Oh shit! I forgot to mention her um, her, her uh, horns kind of look like antlers. Oh, interesting. So it's yeah. just rain. Oh, yeah, here, from let me. Uh, do I need to reference a different pedophile? Please yes. stop. Mm. Stop. Let's, let's stop talking about, about um, pedophiles. Man, it's been such a long time since I've what? been to that island. God. 
<laughs> Stop making work for me that I won't do. <laughs> you forged my name in the Epstein flight log. Anyways, um, He's continuing onward, Isla's going straight up into the flames. Uh, literally doesn't care because she's trying to find Khaldun because literally she needs him to go buy things uh, for her. <laughs> Dalton? Yes? If, if, if the fish woman is to enter this room, I would like to pounce from the shadows upon her. No! Well, okay, let's see. first off, there are no shadows. Yeah, it's oh, kind of it everything's on fire yeah, right on now. Fire. Yeah. But you did yeah, roll a. I, what'd you roll on a self check? 11. 11. 11. I, what is Isla's passive perception? 11. 12, I think. Isla's passive perception? It's 11. Oh, it is? Okay. He meets it, which means he beats it. Which means that you don't Let's notice go. him when you walk in. <laughs> the 7 1 star. fucking wolf man. <laughs> he's like a. He, he's like hit like a coat rack. <laughs> No. He's like stretching I... to fit the door frame. <laughs> like a cat. Like... No, I imagine he's like Go he's holding onto the door. Go ahead the door's and open, he's holding onto it. And he's like all upper body strength, just like horizontal. Holding himself up. Which is funny because he has no strength. Ooh. Anyway. So Yeah, no, he's Go wheezing pretty Taylor. loudly. <laughs> Go ahead and enter. She so. hesitates to enter. It's on fire. Oh, suddenly that, that didn't matters. stop you before. <laughs> I am that peacefully, doesn't matter. I'm peacefully sitting on my uh, half of bed now. Elton, I had an idea. Let me hear your idea. I need to shed my skin for my idea. Okay. Well, it won't be long rest. You can do that. Okay. I need a long rest in the sewer then. You cannot. Anyway. Right I, we, we you that. long rest, you wake up, you are gone because the crocodile is uncharmed. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, doesn't last so long. I rolled, I rolled good enough. Anyway, she opens the door. Okay. She opens the yeah, door. It's... Go ahead and enter. She Walk opens in. the door. I want to say she just stands, she like slightly because she's hesitant. She kind of just like uh, either is shouting from the doorway. Or she actually fully goes in and, like, kind of runs over to him. Because she's, like, she's Which still one? running. Slightly. Like, she runs in the door. Okay. So, you see her run in the door. Incorrect. I am there, waiting. <laughs> <laughs> Ready for oh. this bear jump scare her ass. <laughs> There will soon be one wolf inside you. Thank God there was. Thank God you didn't Whereas give birth to Freddy Fazbear. Kind of yeah, you mean like. Uh, if, uh, if I did my job, I just threw in a FNAF jump scare. Roll for. Whoa. Whoa. But I probably didn't do my job. Don, you yeah. should definitely I find like that one these where it's few like words a, to her. What's good, gang? How are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> as I'm sitting on top of What's her, good, gang? as I'm how are you sitting doing? on top of her, like baring my teeth at her, just okay. How are you doing? Grapple gang? time. Not what I was expecting. Maddie and her, roll a strength mm. athletics check. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, you gotta manage one. to actually get on. My... You can now, Isla, I'd like you to make. Okay. Now make a make strength a athletics or a dex acrobatics. Is Isla's strength higher than. Yes. It is, yeah. <laughs> Probably, yes. Yeah. I'm not surprised. I'm going to do strength. Okay. I got a 12. <laughs> that is. Dang, I just got gripped. I just got gripped by a little ass fish, bro. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you can just roll the same thing. All that gooning. <laughs> and for All what? All that gooning for nothing. And for what? Gooning got rid of Taylor, my don't say gooning. You Must know. more Taylor, goon. You're a little shit. kid. You can't say gooning. Yeah. So, how does how does Isla like counter this? How does, how does Isla, what? the four foot tall fucking fish woman? No, she's three. A... Sorry, three, three six. Seven. It's three, three seven. seven. 
deflect the seven it's foot one. Because I can finagle my way through things. <laughs> the thing is, you, you were supposed to roll a, stealth, a, a, a strength against, which means you just, just overpower him. him. I assume oh, yeah. she, like, breaks free of his Some grasp. Some people are very unpredictable. Out. We're very unpredictable in our strength. Thank Beauty you. Of the small. Wait in. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> so anyways, okay. I get his grasp, and then I dart my way my little fish butt over to Khaldun and cower in this burning room. I get very angry. <laughs> kitten, kitten, your alpha wolf is angry. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, fuck God. Hey, yo, what's good, kitten? Your alpha wolf's angry. Real stop angry. Stop speaking, please. <laughs> alpha please stop speaking. Is angry. You better not make your little fish. <laughs> it's Calder, so good because he's cutting out. Please, take him stop. Little meat, you better not get him anger away from me. me. Get him away from me. I'm an alcoholic, a raging one. Get whatever you. that thing is away from me. So, is at this point, at this time, you will hear yelling from outside a woman's voice going we are the proper authorities <laughs> no yay it's the proper authorities i'll do not it. again <laughs> it's time have you ever heard of ultra kill caldoon we're gonna do not an the, ultra not kill again. reference not again <laughs> but the they ultra kill is not canon to this universe don't i have a question yet. they see me right them. We're um, going to kill them. They're currently we're outside, them, yelling Kaldun. up through like the window. So they're outside. Oh, uh, so the burning house. You Burn ready in. to kill all Did of I these exit people? the house before they appeared, or like? You did. Uh, no, did you? Or did you just like chill in the lobby? I did Kaldun, leave did the camera turn into. A I did leave soup. the house. So you're you're out but, of like, the building. I am still like kind of sitting next to it though, so they would see me. So yeah, you would have seen this. Um. You actually recognize it's the same woman from the other night. Um, oh, not again. She has short red hair, uh, and she's wearing, like, Why? a breastplate, and she has, like, a red um, cl uh, clothes under it. And she has uh, her two goons with her. And she yells up, This is One the proper authority! Goons? <laughs> and uh, she looks at you and says, Is there anyone left inside? Do anything? She Caldun, do me? I have all yes. rights to take I would like one to of look these over... bombs right here in my hand and just throw it at that woman? Caldun. Caldun. Let's see. Caldun. I count on my out. fingers. Okay, one of Papa de Hendox is telling us something. Wait. We need to kill this motherfucker. What happened to the one guy? Who? <laughs> Mike. Mike. No, no, no. The guy that was with us, the furry guy. I you saw haven't two seen people him. in there before I left. You haven't Did seen they him. leave? We haven't seen Good. I didn't Anyways. notice Isla, so I'm just gonna say that I saw two people, those being INR and Calhoun. Anyways. Good. Um Calhoun, do I have all rights to take one of these bombs that I have in my uh in my hand and throw it out this window at that woman? No, you yes, do not. I Why? I already I, did, while you let me go one moment, free. One moment. It was I very know. joyful. Yes, Khaldun. I want you to turn yourself in and non-lethally escape. I know you can do it. Turn myself mm -hmm. in and non-lethally escape. Non-lethal. So I can still firebolt people and sever their limbs. But Correct. I can't kill them. Correct. Okay. Will do. Will do, sir. <laughs> Does he, like, jump out I... of the second story window? <laughs> jump out of the second story window. <laughs> Don't roll or anything. Jump I land straight up on my feet. Straight up on my feet. My knees don't even bend. <laughs> what? <laughs> and I would like to turn myself in. Hello, gang. I am turning myself in for my various crimes. I did, in fact, set this building on fire, 
It was a little trolling on my part. Um, <laughs> what can I say, y'all? A little. You can't talk. You exploded a building. Um, the woman looks at you and it's she has actually like, blew up. A <laughs> tough expression on her face. And she has like a, a scar running up her cheek, and she says, "I'm still in my straight jacket and shit, right?" Yeah. Yes, you are. Covered in blood. Covered in blood. Yeah, your face is covered in blood because you've eaten multiple people's faces. <laughs> and Tilly says, we've had reports of a number of incidents this night. There was a similar explosion at um, a, a small <laughs> complex down uh, to the west, a few blocks. Were you behind that as well? Um, I do not like explosions. I prefer other ways of doing things, like fire. Um, so, no, I did not. Okay, second question. Are you related to any wasp-related mayhem that might have occurred this <laughs> night? No. No, sir. I'm a woman. Third question. <laughs> Third question. Do you know anyone who might have done the these man. things? <laughs> the Muffin Man. <laughs> the Muffin Man. Uh, I'm going to keep it real if you, Chief. I do know, but I'm not going to tell you. Mm. <laughs> um, I would be snitching, and snitches like, get stitches. I feel like INR doesn't know what sex is. <laughs> yeah. no. Liberty this no. mm. INR knows eating people's faces. <laughs> Ionara has heard of the word sex before. He thinks it's a type of food. Well, <laughs> my favorite oh, flavor. Yeah. Ordinarily, I would bring you in, but today was not. An, it, this was not an attack like any other. So I, <laughs> I, 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 there's someone else here that um <laughs> needs to speak with you because he needs to know the truth, and I need to know the truth, and you have the truth. Bring him in, and a man walks out from Deal. the alley. He does not have a shirt on. He's absolutely jacked. <laughs> oh oh no! no. This is my, this is my God. a good friend of it's mine, Mike. Fruit seller with a shirt. <laughs> and he looks at you Why? and he says, "I can never get rid of this man." My home was blown up, and you say you know who did it. <laughs> No. No. <laughs> no. I am not as bad again. You better not. Do I hear this? Do I hear this? Yes, yeah, sure. Yeah. I want to hear it, but I hear it as well. I, I would like. It. Yeah, you're like right. You're like a floor above them. So I'm immediately looking at this guy's crotch. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> Bro, he is huge. Bro is massive. He's hung, like hung oh, yeah. like a gorilla. Oh, yeah. No, not like a gorilla. <laughs> Can I get the sex roll? <laughs> Seduction? Seduction roll. And he, he looks at you and says, There was innocent people in that building. I need to and they they lost their life tonight. Oh. I need to know. What is what? Chief, Chief, I will only tell you. You provide the best of the best, taking it down on that gangsta shit. <laughs> <laughs> he looks at you and says, well, I That's do lovely. sell the best of the best. You want apples? I got apples. You want oranges? I got you know, oranges. I said that, taking it down on that gangsta shit. <laughs> uh, I understand, he says. Let me roll to see if he, he can hit you. Me. Oh shit, I'm about to die. You're dead. By the way. <laughs> You're I'm dead. Consecrating smite. Mike is the best I'm character. Be he's done it. He, he's a one hit wonder. Does I get a, like a magic so parry with the firebolt? Does a 23 hit? I'm using yes. a using... <laughs> Yeah. By a lot. Hey, hey don't want to tell us the base for that? <laughs> no, I don't. No. <laughs> You take. That was a few dice. <laughs> <laughs> it 
that was. How do you want to do that? You take 13 damage. <laughs> Almost half a tell. Can, can I counter that with the magic parry? Can I get the uh, <laughs> parry? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, you're kind of Don't fucked. Take oh. again. Oh, Wait, did, have you seen the character sheet for this guy? No. I'm not using that character sheet. I'm sorry. I know you're not. I figured you made a new one. That one wasn't balanced. <laughs> uh, Dude, th this one's really not. I'm knocked good. out. I'm on the ground dead. I don't get back up. <laughs> what health did you have? Yeah, he has 30 health. I said 13! Yeah, and that's almost half his health. <laughs> I'm yeah. going on the ground. I'm backing away. I'm on Blood of the is away like a dog. Blood I'm whimpering. I'm whimpering. Terrified. My tail is tucked between my legs. My tail is tucked between my legs. <laughs> I just got the god slap. I just got the god slap. God, <laughs> he just got god handed. <laughs> He's raring to go for more, too. He grabs you by the fur on top of your head and like pulls you up like this. Like just, oh, shit. And he says, feel like talking now? Um, bro, please let me go on the gang, or I'll be have to commune with Epa the Hindox. Um, please let me go, Uwu. We're all persuasion. Oh, I don't know how that would persuade anyone. I don't know, man. I got a four. I got a three. <laughs> three. He holds, he holds his head and says, mm. and he like lethal weapons you just like a onto the onto the ground just in the face. I got one shot. I'm reduced and die. He just got dancer of the boreal valley. Crap. Take four damage. <laughs> Wait, and what's interesting is that Caldun and Isla are just sitting there watching this. By the way, so he's at thirteen health. Yes, he is. I'm dead. <laughs> now I have a question. Would you like to roll for initiative? Uh, what does that mean? That means that we're entering combat. I... Uh... No, because I've died. <laughs> I've <I'm> been <laughs> screwed. <laughs> okay. He brings your head back up and he says, I will spill the beans. Now? Okay, good. Who did it? Yes, sir. I'll spill the beans. I'll spill the beans. <laughs> I overheard about someone having bombs. I could smell them. I could smell the gunpowder no. on them. It is a small child who has the appearance of a fish. I'm sorry for ever asking for anything else. Please don't hurt me. Let me go. Let Ayana be free. <laughs> Ayana has more people. Be free. He, he, he's holding your head and he says, look, buddy, you'll go free. If you tell me one more thing, where is she? <laughs> she is in the burning building on the second floor. I don't remember what room. I just walked in and I can smell her. She smells like a fish. She looks like one as well. She's very small and she's a child, but she blows things up, I'd assume, for she has gunpowder on her or she had yeah. some sort of explosive on her. I could not make out exactly what it was. Though. Shut Please the fuck up. Why you like fighting like, palms your stomach? <laughs> Stop talking. Also, also, Dalton, Mike knows. <laughs> Who he's talking. Oh, he knows who he's oh, he talking does. about. That yeah, yeah, yeah. He, no. He looks up he at the building. No, I should have killed. I should have put two. I should have put two. I know you're in there, you piece of shit. Come on. Kaldun. We can see. Is Ryan are just being no, dragged now? Am I being dragged I by this man? No, you, 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 he's let you go. He's, he's set you down. Uh, Kaldun, please, for me. <laughs> Isla? I <laughs> don't go open the door for that kind time. fruit seller. Please, please, this one time, this one time, I beg you, I beg you, please. This one Isla time. is learning the definition of fuck around and find out. Did you happen to do anything while you were out? Um, <laughs> maybe, maybe um, a little, a little bombing here, a little bombing there. Um, I was coming back to get some gunpowder. <laughs> mm -hmm. Please help me. <laughs> Please I help will. me. Yeah? You may not have this 
in the ocean or wherever you're from. Yeah. But there's a little thing on land called the consequences of your actions. Please, no, 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 Keldun, I swear, please, no, please. I've already had so many consequences. I'm sorry. Please, please. You know, I'd like to see this person face to face with you. Okay, you can see them. You can see them, but not near yes. me. I don't want to be harmed no, in this place. I want to watch this. <laughs> no, I will die. Die, I swear to you. Did I you like... not just see what was happening out there? Did you not just Open see what happened? The door. <laughs> I love. No. No. Open the door, or I'll drag you to the door and open it myself. Um. um she pulls out. She starts pulling out of palm. <laughs> she is not burned. She starts to pull out of palm. She starts to pull out a bomb, and she's like, "Can I deal with this my way, just for oh, a second? What happens? Oh, just to see what happens. Think just about to see it, what Ella. happens." Taylor, if you I'm throw a bomb at I, that man, I, how do you think he'll react? Don't so make me come in there. there. <laughs> he Once more, die, and then we have to deal with him in cases. Um, Eonor, and he he slips into the the void. We hear we hear the guards outside go. Where'd he go? <laughs> like a sad, it's like a sad violin cover of Party Rock. <laughs> <laughs> he left. Did you just see that? He left. He left. Now that is not good. <laughs> he ratted me out. That little weird thing ratted me out. He didn't have a choice. <laughs> Did you see? What that man did to him? Yes. Now please One protect him. He was I don't have it. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe, maybe can you not have that happen for me? Because I will actually die. I will be splat, pancake, flat. <laughs> I'm going to set a timer. Question, Isla. Mm -hmm. Do you think I want to be like that? No, but you won't have to deal with it as bad. Good. How the fears no man, no man but Mike. I'm grabbing her by the back of her neck. Please, okay. please, 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 please. I assume I don't have to roll for this. Please. Nah, your strength no. is pretty high. Uh, unless she's resisting. I am resisting. Then yeah, Good you have luck. to roll opposing strength checks. Or or you can make a dexterity check if you want, Isla. Whichever one is. Alright, All right, I got a 16. <laughs> <laughs> the consequences of your actions. Uh, That's no. in that one. Oh my God. This is the difference between a father and her child. Her? A father and her? 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 That's what? right, Barry. It was me. <laughs> I was the one who gave birth to you. Please, oh, please. <laughs> I was in the opposite medical booth, getting my pre-vac surgery. <laughs> oh, yes, so can you please? You pretty do not rat me out. I swear, please do not rat me. Please, please. I go to the I front door. I'll do anything. I'll do anything. I'll do anything. I'll do anything. I go to the front door. <laughs> I'll do anything. Please. I turn please. the knob. No, please, please. And I swing it I open. I just literally said I'll do anything. The <laughs> Mike is standing. I want to hide under the bed. She like darts under the bed. Wait, you can't. You don't have that option, buddy. Oh, I do have that option. I feel so bad because like I can't come up with like. Like, because Velfi is just off doing something else. She's not here for this. She was doing like the most safe Can activity. Someone help. Like, Can please she... someone help. Someone no, notice. Someone help. I'm so sorry, bro. Please, well, can well, someone well, notice and help? Please, someone notice and help. I know. Like, what was that? Please. Wolfie is having the time of her life. 
she Velma is having a great time. She's she's critiquing this. I'm like, <laughs> please, in my Velma, mind, you decide to randomly I'm walk in the building. Real quick, I'm actually going to do a quick role performance for these actors on the stage that um, Velma is watching to see. A quick Velma, died. There's one actor who was doing so bad, and Velma was like, "I already know this play." She replaced the whole actor. The way you said that, I was like, like Xenomorph killed him. <laughs> like, just like, hung yes. the actors and took his place. Exactly. Okay. So, um, cut back to the uh, door what? swings Please. open. Please. Caldoon's holding. I'll do anything. I just said I would do anything. Caldoon, please, 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 please. I'll do anything at all. Anything at all. Mike walks up. You know. Anything. Please, 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 please. please. <gasps> I lowered her volume and it's so much I better. <laughs> Stop lowering my volume. Anyway, there please. Is no answer greater than forgiveness. <laughs> I'm sorry. No word greater than silence. <laughs> <laughs> he looks at you, um, Isla. Hello, Hello. Mike. Good evening. I heard my I heard Hello. my sweetie over here had some business <laughs> with you. Yes. Oh no, she no, a not building. at all. No, I didn't. I now, definitely didn't. You didn't see it happen. I, I was in I the was... building. You don't know that. You Mike, don't know that. I wasn't there. I understand that you may be very angry right now. But I only wish for you to do one thing. What are you about to make him do? Teach her a lesson. No! <laughs> no! No! And then toss, like, literally and then I, and then I toss Isla to Mike. No! You and you close the door. <laughs> to roll for initiative. No. I'm going to walk back uh, with Khaldun to watch this from the second story. I would like for you, Isla, to roll for initiative. I need to remember which one that one is. It's that, at the top. Yeah. It's typically just your dex modifier. Okay, yours will be a Brush off my one. hands and... Go sit down back on my comfy pile of uh, now what is ashes? <laughs> <laughs> it's still on fire. <laughs> You're very um, lucky you don't have to breathe. Yeah, it's fine. My con modifier is high enough. I've been in fire before. Well, also, you just, yeah, <laughs> so, uh, cannot find it for the life of me. It's um, it's it's plus one, you know, it's your deck whenever... modifier. You know, in movies where it's like a really dramatic scene, and then there's just like intense music in the background. Blind right now. Look, I had not looked at the. What, why have you guys been adding stuff to the? No, what are you talking about? <laughs> Hang on. Uh, do you have a map? Do you have a map for a this encounter, Dalton? Yep, give me just a second. A posse's oh, no, a posse's a posse's Lord. having the fight for life. I'm not fighting. Yeah, a posse's chilling with the gator. Uh, yeah. Taylor is having the fight of her life. <laughs> I'm gonna go. <laughs> Taylor lost the fight for her life and is now <laughs> stepping right into the fight of her life. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna take a nap so I can shed my skin and relax. <laughs> Okay. Velfi is one-upping the worst actor in the world. So once more, I think it's the it's Sam Link. It's in okay. mod chat. So okay, hang on. Mod chat. I need to see this go down. So I assume Ephraim didn't follow Khaldun because the house is on fire and that would hurt, so I am just going to be watching from the sidewalk. I am perfectly content with being on fire right now. <laughs> I knew this would happen. I knew for a fact this would happen. I like how he's the champion. Mike doesn't fuck around. Mike does not fuck around. 
<laughs> oh my god. Oh no. Don't forget the, the lady and her little goons are here too. They're not participating yeah, I, yet, I, but I I don't think they'll need to honestly. <laughs> Uh -oh. <laughs> please. I literally buy Taylor. I beg you. Buy Taylor. else. What's the matter? I do anything. Please. It's just like a town. Please. Kind of like a neighborhood area. Please. Do you not see it? It's in Macho. No. Wait, what? Please. I don't want to die. Please. <laughs> okay. Don't worry. I don't want to lose so I, character. I, I told him character. not to kill you at least. So, what did you roll for your initiative? Isla. I don't know. I can't Just, fight. <laughs> what do you mean you can't She's fight? Such just roll a it's the same modifier as your dexterity, so just roll a dexterity check. Oh my god. It's a plus one. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Wow. <laughs> I was gonna say you're very lucky because Mike also rolled a three. But his oh, dexterity is oh. higher than you, so he goes first, did he? Why? No. Hold on. Where's that one? Hold on. Let me pull up a... What the heck, man? <laughs> have any of you watched American Dead? I have, yeah. This is what I'm imagining right now. <laughs> Why? Okay, so it's his turn first. He's going to walk up to you, Isla. And he's going to ball up his fist and he's going to attempt to punch you. Why? Oh, wait, I wait, forgot. Wait, does that roll the nat one? Wait, I forgot I have something. I have a dagger. Yeah. And shotgun. And bombs. And bombs. Oh, oh, cool. There's, there's one mind. thing you don't have if you're considering this, and it's a will to live. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so I have a question. Mm -hmm. Does a 27 hit? Don't. Mm. Yes. Cool. Yes. <laughs> Don't don't kick her while she's down. <laughs> oh, God. You can't Why? Why are you all doing this? You take nine damage. Okay. I don't know how. Reminder that he's just using his fists. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I have no idea how to change anything, so y'all would also have to reminder that. that my fists deal a base six damage. Okay. So do mine. What is his strength? Yes. Oh, here's the thing. His fists are a weapon, unlike your your. <laughs> what? You're currently at 19. Uh, hell. I love. I do have unarmed strike on mine. You do, which is you punch. Taylor, it. don't Everyone use it. Yeah. I don't recommend yeah. it. But he believes I in a fair fight. Unarmed strike once. So fine. he'll I'm say. I'm saying I do have. So it is now your turn. He'll, I'll say he believes in a fair fight. So he's only gonna punch you once. Okay. Once. Um. Once. Um, I don't know what to do. What do you do? I was gonna say, at least you gave Taylor an easy intro to combat, but I think you gave her a thing. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Easy intro to combat, huh? Yeah, it doesn't at all. <laughs> yeah, Mike the Fruit <laughs> Salesman. <laughs> I'm Mike teaching the her that her actions salesman. have consequences. Is there anything wrong with this? So, Isla. No. Yes. You can take an action now. I don't know what to do. Well, you can do a lot of things. You could you attack. You could you cast a run. spell. You can run. You can disengage, which means that you can run. run away without. Well, you can run disengage. Away. Okay. That means that you don't pro pro provoke an attack of opportunity. So you can move 30 feet away in one, in one, in one turn, you can move 30 feet away. Okay. 20 feet. Dom, does this count as a net oh, positive action? I will run away, because I want to run. I don't want to attack. Feet is 20 speed. I don't wanna, so I don't an attack of opportunity failure is, yeah. it, is an attack against you by them. I don't want to attack, so... What? That's why you're disengaged, so he, he can't attack you while you're running away now. Yeah. Yeah. So you can By run the way, 20 feet away because you have very short legs. Yeah. Does does me not resisting Mike count as a net positive action? <laughs> what? For no, karma? Right? No. Because Isla did just attempt to murder a family of four. I didn't know. 
I personally think it, it, was it, was, it wasn't like a it house. Is lawful. It was a, it was it was a it was a complex with multiple live-in homes. You asked an old woman for directions. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the right here. Yes. You are. So you know. Somehow you are. Yeah, Taylor killed that child. Taylor killed that old lady. He did. No, I didn't. Yeah, no, did. Mike no, is the did. great. He saved everyone. Actually, Dalton, no. did she kill you that only saved his actually, family wait, from no. what he said. Yeah, no, I actually wait, no. his yeah, family. I like... Okay, so is that would that be all you're doing, or is or you do, do you have a you have a bonus action, which means that you could. Ah, oh, shit. It wasn't that powerful. I think his internet then. Do you know how fire works, Isla? Oh, back. Sorry about that. All okay. of these buildings are made of wood. Yeah. Anyway. Um, you, it wasn't that powerful. You do have a bonus action. It's fire. Anyway, so, what? You don't have a whole lot of bonus actions available. Dalton, to you is the old lady done? Yeah. You don't know. You didn't stick around to find out. Yeah, I didn't. So, uh, is there anything else? Will you be using a bonus action? Is what I'm asking. Because. You still have that. Um, sure. So, bonus action. Uh, you don't have a whole lot as, a, as an officer right now. Mainly, you can really just cast a magic stone where you can throw rocks at him that are really fucking strong for some reason. Sure. <laughs> also, do that. Okay. Fun fact. I guess. Baby shrimp are called shrimplets. Cool. Roll a <laughs> d20 and then add six to that to see if you hit. This little shrimplet's about to get fried. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. Taylor, I suggest you just run away. She is. Yeah, I'm gonna run away. So you got a total of. Alright. So... Yeah, I wanna run away. <laughs> so that's for a total of. Math is annoying. I can't do simple addition. I'm sad. 14. Maybe he'll have an. Uh, nope. <laughs> I'm gonna run away. Nope. I just I said like... that. Honestly, I feel like he would take the hit just as a gentleman's. <laughs> yeah, he, you know what? I'll let him. I'll say that he takes the hit to the face. Roll damage, <laughs> which is he's a, a blood knight. Plus he gets four. pissed off the more damage you deal with him. He's taking it so easy on you. Oh. <laughs> mm. Mm. He heard the bomb and it immediately cut to Sisyphus' face, being like, ah, a visit. (laughs) Oh my god. I got a six. So you deal ten damage. (laughs) I can't wait for the Mike the Fruit salesman fan cam. He begins bleeding from one nose. One nose? (laughs) (laughs) One (laughs) nostril. (laughs) (laughs) He has more than one nose. You might, you don't know. What, what is this creature? You unlocked, congratulations, Sorry. you unlocked his second attack. <laughs> he begins bleeding from one nostril. I mean, I'm... <laughs> Phase two of nine. So, <laughs> it is now his turn. Is he evolving? Yes. It's more like Why? he's releasing his limits. This is even my final four. Now, here's the thing, you're very small, and thus you are very slow, but he is pretty tall. So. And therefore can drop kick you from this range. He, it does not take him very Judgment. long to catch up with Judge. him. Can I just say I keep running? I I don't want to move. Yeah, you're not I, fast I enough to move. escape him. Yeah. Yes, I could, can be. I could, I could walk and catch up to you, you can't if you were running. Just you're... so you know. So now he's going to like Run up and like punch you in the back of the head, and let's see if oh. he hits. Well, you gotta be quick because I actually have to go. Okay. So. Yeah. Let's see. Don't worry. That hits. I'm not even gonna bother. That hits. <laughs> what was it? Uh, twenty-four. <laughs> <laughs> that would have crumpled my armor. <laughs> Deals. Deals 11 damage. Isla, catch this overhead. (laughs) Okay, so Isla is at 8 out of 35 HP right now. Yep. 
And because you have now hit him and he's kind of mad, he's, he's even more angry. He sees her as a legitimate threat. He's going to bust out his second attack. Oh, Can I gonna... please just run away? Like, you can't. Just run. Never you can't. Like, this is his second away. attack. I don't this is his turn. Like, can I just run? No. Like, run straight. Like, no. leave. Run. No. no. Why can't no. I do that? Because it's Why not your I? turn. <laughs> when will you learn that your <laughs> actions have consequences? I swear. Hey, if hold no, up. Wait. What if you make me? I will be quite pissed. He meets it, so he beats it. You were the it. one that decided to blow up the factory. Oh, did he roll a 15? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> 11. I, I presume this is not. Oh, legal. yeah. <laughs> does, does, how much, how much did you have? She's at nine. Uh, she is at negative two HP. Oh, cool! Currently. So she drops. She's yeah, no, I, she I, drops. <laughs> also, I, I thought it was you had to get one over the AC to beat it. No, it's no, equal. it's you meet, so you beat. Ah, okay. Easy way to remember. It is at this moment that I will step out of the house. <laughs> he looks at you and he like grabs Isla by like the back of her collar and says, "No." Why? She will suffer. She will hurt. She will burn for those she has burned, and only then does she have my permission to die. What? To die? To die. Oh my God. What? I will permit a lot of things. Can I go now? You I are think unconscious. I... You're no. not conscious? Still, I'm saying this as in just general to me. Can uh, my... Can, can, oh, yeah, no. Uh, you is can. It... If you need to go, you can totally leave. It's, it's okay. <laughs> No, not that. I need to make sure my character's okay first. Because <laughs> y'all are just going to kill me. Well, no. No. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. No. No. Mm. Not happening. I'm not trying to kill you, just so you know. He, well, it he sounds like it. He looks at you and he says, No, that's your fault, not mine. He looks at you and says, how does one like you come to care for a creature as demonic as this, as black-hearted, birthed from the bleakest wombs? First off, bleak is white. Second of all, <laughs> I said her heart was black. <laughs> Not to wound. How does white? How does white birth black? <laughs> well, if you must well. know, racist. <laughs> Why? Yes, I do enjoy racing. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, he says. How can someone like you care for a creature like this? Mike. Take a moment in my shoes. Do not presume familiarity with me, monster. Imagine if I were beating up one of your children right now. How would you feel? Well, I can tell you exactly how I feel because they were in a building that she blew up! <laughs> So I could be, I know what you feel because I'm feeling it right now. And I feel the same. So what are you so, going to do? Since your children are alive, it would only be right if you kept mine alive as well. Yeah, the fact that she's knocked out. She's obviously your alive. judgment. She's obviously going to have to do some hard time. You've given your judgment, and now it is my turn as a parent to give mine. He looks at you, and he says, that might be true, but she still blew up a building. This is a city. We have laws. Yes. But she does have... Some leeway on this. She doesn't know what laws are. <laughs> well, she can't say that. So that also is not yeah, a defense. She <laughs> yeah, that's she not a defense. She doesn't know what they are. <laughs> Ignorance is not absolution. Because she wasn't born with laws existing. Sounds <laughs> um, like when German came to America and was like, "Well, we don't have this law in my homeland, so clearly I can do it." <laughs> 
Not her. <laughs> I'm kidding, though. This law does not exist in the fatherland. <laughs> you see, I as a fish don't have to <laughs> go with these human laws. <laughs> so, How long would she what be would be Mm. How would I know? That's for the courts to decide. Mm. I love how none of these. There's still guards over there, right? Yeah, Mike for killing her. He didn't kill her. He just beat her within an inch of her life. She was. He was gonna kill her. <laughs> yeah. All right. Then I tell him. I'll tell him. Then give her to the guards. And let them sort it out. Fine. And he picks, he throws her to the guards who catches her. And he looks you in the and, eye and says, hmm? No, wait, you can And do it. if you need any help recovering, I personally will help you. My family wasn't the only one in that fire. There are people that couldn't make it out. Can you help them? Can you bring them back? I don't think you can. Well, we know from the dead, you say. <laughs> Landon, no. Caldew, no. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Landon. Yes. Yes, Landon. Do it. Do it. I dare you. Do it. That was my actual response. Oh, but yeah. I am. I am going to cut in. Ephrael is going to cut in and say, "Better to not." Do well, we not know people that can bring people back from the dead? We do. As you are known conspirators, we have to bring you in as well. That is um, fair. Good. Now, all of us. Yes. I, no, I group. Now, where are the other two? The other two? Uh, those being Braylon the and The Mushroom Richard. and the Tiefling. Hmm. Do they even see the Tiefling? Beats me. Really? Yeah. Mushroom? I don't think they... I don't think they did They would anything. have not known us. Yeah. Yeah, we didn't do anything. No, but y this is Mike. You did... You were there when he sold you fruit. Oh, oh right. <laughs> he remembers you. I, no, he didn't. No, he didn't meet me because I went to the weapon shop, so I never knew Mike. Okay. Then, well, then he just asks the mushroom. I don't actually know where the mushroom is. None of them know where I am. I have not left. I'm taking that long rest. I didn't in see her in our room, so I presume she left at some point. So she's probably off doing something. But he and he. He t he turns back and he orders the two two like extras <laughs> that I'm just because they don't have names and they don't matter. Are there There's three? Two. There are three, but they one of them is kind of important. Oh. The other two are just you know whatever. Um, to to handcuff you two, but then he looks at the third. He looks at them and says, "Take them in and put an ATB on uh the mushroom." And then the guard looks at, well, the the lady with the short hair goes, "Because you know you're not like a in the law for you can't actually order." <laughs> Us to do anything. I mean, we're going to, but like, stay in your lane, bro. But it's Mike. Not my mom. Ah, uh, but I would check somewhere that's dark and wet. Mm. If that helps. She is Rude. a mushroom. Rude. I assume that feels they mildly found... racist, but okay. I assume they found Braylon. I don't know. Well, I, 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 as, you, as you mentioned, as was mentioned, um, they don't know that Braylon, uh, that Velfi is with you guys, so currently. There is no warrant out for her arrest. Okay. <laughs> Velfi has to bust us out of prison. Yeah. So, do you two um, like resist to being shackled? Nope. No. Okay. I'm unconscious. Well, yeah. <laughs> so. Yep. That's why he said two. So now we're going to one more, once more cut because I have a feeling that this person wants to do this, so we're going to do this, and then we'll have one more cut after this. Uh, a posse, you're still in the sewer. Is there anything else you're doing? Because you mentioned something earlier. And also, hold on, I'm going to stop you one second. Now that I'm unconscious, basically, uh, I gotta go. Okay, that's fine. Yep. So, yeah, yeah. goodbye. We're almost done, so. Yeah. Goodbye.
I need to take my long rest and then I need to do something else after that okay. so I can shed my skin and do something. You can tr you can attempt to long rest. Although um the charmed condition Please. won't last that long. Hmm? It only lasts like a minute. Yeah. So Trump condition yeah. will not last that long. And you have no guarantee that Mike, the alligator, God, I hate you for that. Uh, you have no idea, uh, guarantee that the crocodile will, in fact, remain docile. I fed him. I got a net 20 on animal handling. I'm, so there's a good chance. I'm just, I'm just putting the facts in front of you. Please, Dalton. You're you know, gross. Richly, you know what happened That's last right. time Dalton had to flip a coin? I'm not flipping a coin. I'm just laying out the facts. I gave you tattooey for Mike, so I'm gonna put Richly, trust in you. Trust in the crocodile. Would you like to I'm, long rest? I'm gonna trust in the crocodile, but please, Dalton, you're gonna want to see this because okay, I'm sure. changing. I want to change to spring, and okay. if you'll look at face step for spring. <laughs> Dear Christ, your character is so complicated. <laughs> Uh, why'd you make a unique and interesting character? Oh. Dudes. Oh. <laughs> Just make a character with like a 24 AC like me. Jeez. Just be happy I'm a barbarian and I don't have any spells. You do have spells, though. You basically have spells. Basically, but I don't... Not, not my spells. Not, no spells here. So, okay. please don't... You enter your trance. The world kind of fades away. You're still conscious, but, you know. Um, and eight hours pass, and now we're going to cut. Because it's a long rest is eight hours, so that's where we'll end for you. But, <laughs> Velfi. I got it for the end of the session, please. Yay! I finally get to do something. Yeah. I'm so you could have done something, or you could have said something. but Actually, you know what? Velfi, you perform. I would like you to roll a performance check for me, actually. Probably with advantage, right? No. <clears throat> no. Why would it be with advantage? Why are you stupid? Well, She's just proficient in it. Roll that performance. Oh. Roll that perform. Why is my thing not lo? It's not loading on my side. It's fine. You got a thirteen. Okay. We decide you do pretty well. You know, you are kind of rusty. You've been out of the game for a while. You know, but you're back in it. You it takes you a minute. Uh, you haven't performed. Obviously, you didn't have time to rehearse. But you're you're in it. You um, successfully get rid of one of the cast members. God rest his soul. And you replace him. And you perform. Everyone's very happy. It's a very good show. Um, and you walk backstage. Do I get money? <laughs> you walk backstage. And one of the actors goes, so who are you? And why are you here? Um, don't worry about it. Neat. Let's just say, let's just say, I'm in, I'm in a, I don't know a long time to fucking. <laughs> You're taking a long time to fuck. You're taking a long time to come up with a sentence. She, let's she, um, <laughs> I'm just a, just a funny little guy. Fascinating. Anyway, well, you did a job, so go talk to the boss. He's in his office. Okay, I'm gonna go. Uh, can you point me in the direction of said boss? Oh yeah, sure. His office is. Uh, you go up those stairs and then through the door and then you're on the left, and then. I'm gonna go to the boss. Okay. The boss. You the walk boss. Up, you the boss. The boss. open this wooden door, and it's very nice. Like, like the the smoke in this office. Um, there's a nice mahogany desk. <laughs> there's a fat it's man mahogany. bald on top. He's smoking mm. a cigar. My dad. He looks at you and says, "You got chops, kid. I like yours." You drew crowds tonight when that idiot couldn't deliver. And the Thank best you. of all, I heard your 
fresh. What you knew? I hate you knew the impact. expressions you're making. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I kind of just showed up. Uh, Perfect. A few hours ago. I love non-unionized workers. <laughs> okay, we went there. <laughs> That's probably the worst part of the episode. <laughs> but I cut that out before the fork forklift drivers from Indiana start striking. <laughs> oh dear God! I can hear them overhead. They found me. No. They're slowly lifting their forks onto our onto your building as we speak. I got... Gosh, you haven't paid me in four months! Shut up! <laughs> Shut the fuck up! I'm making a movie now. Daddy's making a movie. Anyway, he looks at me and says, Now, ordinarily, that your, your kind of chops would lead me to give you a few more roles, and I'm definitely interested. But I got a, I got a business partner here who wants to talk to you. <laughs> What is Gabriel doing? <laughs> Sorry. My bottom lip burns. Because I've been holding it in my mouth for like the entire campaign. Uh, it's at this point that from the like the um from above, uh, like a panel in the ceiling opens up and down drops a tall woman. And she has on like grey robes with a hood over. And she pulls a sword on you. And she says, I need information and revenge. Did you know Jacques? And that's what would end it. Oh. Did we continue?